Welcome back to Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup, everyone. I've started up a troll here, because I think someone recommended me a troll of Woodyard. I don't think I've done one before, but I'm going to do one again. See how that goes. I thought it was an Ice Spicer, because I haven't done a troll Ice Spicer before, I don't think. At least I hope not. Try to win a new combo. I know Dungeon Level 1's really easy with these trolls. It's hard to get one killed, because you can't regen. And you got a decent chunk of health, so nothing can really damage you. Apart from maybe a D1 null, but hey, that's always tough. Oh, and I guess a Venom weapon can also in theory be a problem. If it gets you lethally poisoned or something, because I don't think you start with a curing. What do I start with? Uh, Flame Wand, which I got quivered, but probably shouldn't. And I've got a charming and an ice blast, I a typical one there for an enchanter. Oh, it's boomerangs. I should grab the throwing weapons. I'm definitely going to get into throwing at some stage. Don't start with any evocations. I start with two. Mm. Right, because I'm a troll and they're bad at evocations. Oh, well. Not much I could do to belt that. I might just pull these guys back a bit. Mm, more slugs for me to run up to, but how much damage does a dart slug even do? I don't think it's a huge amount. Alright, well, first level dungeon wasn't too bad. Didn't quite get me to third level, but I imagine the next monster pretty much well. Maybe not this one. Maybe the next one after this one. Nope, that did it. Um, I think I just get strength. I mean, I got seven in, which is not bad for a troll. I think they usually start with a bit worse. I guess Artifact is a smart or something. I don't know. Oh, hey, Zen. Um, Zen's not the plan. Would you just the plan? I'll just pull these guys back to here, somewhere where I can actually find them a choke point, although most of them didn't notice me, right? Alright, let me go rid of those. Do I start with like an entire thing of region? I think I do. One health a turn sounds like quite a lot. What level is this? Level 1 is the mutation. Huh. I thought level 1 was like less effective, but maybe not. Seems quite effective to me. I guess maybe the each level is worth about the same as one amulet worth or something. I should get rid of the adder, I think. That's a dangerous one with the poison. I haven't got any resistance to that one just yet. Oh, it's a longsword there. I've actually done a troll with a longsword before. They got, like, Maxwell's Thermic Engine or something. And, like, they weren't very good with it, but it was also Maxwell's Thermic Engine, so it worked out. And I got the, like, troll blade title out of it as well, which is great. And that's that level done. All right. Uh, not going to get the temple just yet. That's, what, dungeon level 4 to 7, I think. That did confuse me. At least I'm in the middle of a corridor, so... Can't exactly wander out of this corridor or anything. Oh, there's an adder. Good old adder, come on, move next to me. Just moving back to get an next to me, because that's sometimes more effective than moving up to it when it's close. Because you don't get a, uh, getting the initial attack against you or anything. Oh, is that a statue form? Well, I'll take that. We'll see how long it takes me to get it going. But, like, statue form as a troll is pretty good. In fact, I think that was the plan even, to be a statue form troll. That was a weapon shop. I probably don't need that one. Let's see. We've got the Scepter of Torment. Which is actually a pretty good base of flail thing, but I don't think so. Scorched Halberd, which is an artifact, and a steaming phalanx, which is also an artifact. If there was anything there, it would be the... Oh, hey, that guy's got protection. Um... Oh, uh, it's probably fine. I didn't really want the other... Oh, there's another one trying to surround me. But yeah, if there was anything, I don't think it would be the Scepter of Torment that I grab, but I don't think so. I think I just give it chloring people. I do 16 damage, which is uh, pretty decent damage. Oh, spellbooks. We'll see. What's this first one? This gloomy battling? 
It's Sigatuba's putrefaction, force and fuselage, enemy dead and sublimation of blood, sure. Wait, battles, manifold assault, maybe. But it's like really late game. Some portations, mammals, splinter, sure. Cost hibernation, fugue, anguish. I think it was fugue somewhere else. I don't know. That'll do. Oh, there's also a book of the hunter, which I think it's called, uh, What's the portal projectile called now? Dimensional bullseye or something. Oh, a cloak of willpower. I want that one. I've already got a ring of willpower, so it's not like super needed, but I do want it. I, of course, am not ready to fight crazy youth just yet. Usually you want to fight it like just before going to lair or something, depending how strong your character is, but just before lair is pretty good. Oh, this. Good old this medals. Also, I think Maglev rework finally landed on Trunk, if I'm correct. I have to do my next character as a MacLab worshipper. I haven't looked like through the changes, so I kind of be going in blind, but hey. Oh, unarmed improved to four. Because I don't think I started with any unarmed, unfortunately. It's an art fight, so I started with. Did you start with any weapon skill? No, I didn't. I just started with like a little club as well, which wasn't. Massively useful as a weapon. I immediately swapped away from it. Oh, I can't wear the gloves. Oh, what's this? Plus for great sort of pain. Sure. Hey, that's a early temple. Let's go in. See if I can find a Wujin. Oh yeah, that looks like Wujin. In fact, is that everyone in here? No, there's missing your del no Ushkeo Rune Fetas. Sure. But anyway, let's go grab some Wujin. Do I start with the ability to do anything? I start with large attacks, and then as I gain a little bit of piety, I get the whirlwind ones. Lunge is fine. Oh, hey, Ogre. Um, I, sh I should maybe throw these boomerangs? I'm not sure. It's not doing the most. A lunge attack, the guy. Right, that was a bit sketchy. I mean, mm, when do I get throwing? Not yet. Right, I mean, dungeon level 4 is super early for an ogre, but it is kind of a little early. So do I have an identifier? See what this is. Oh, inhalation, okay. Identify, there we go. Um, I'll do this other scroll, so that one's teleport. And I'll do these two common potions. I've got heal wounds, nice. I've got curing, also nice. Oh, a good old abandoned shop. Nothing to see there. Um, I also don't know how far I am from the Oz of Wary, right? Very distant from the Oz of Wary. Hmm. And I'm probably at the bottom of the map, but it's hard to really tell. I might just go... I might just go up and to the right, just away from where I am. Oh, poison resist. Not sure how much that will help in Oz of Wary, but they do sometimes have scorpions in them. Oh, is that a potion shop? I might go check it out on the way to my Oz of Wary. Ooh, I should just, uh, la slash this guy. Okay. Ouch. And then I should, um, ice blast this guy. There we go. Okay, still very distant, though, from that old very Oh, there's more stuff here. Lots of stuff here. So there's a bite, a lignification. Uh, I might grab the heal wounds. But there's also some more, like, haste and stuff. Oh, there's a resistance. Now the heal wounds. A haste. More curing if I need it. Anyway, I should heal up. Oh. No, with a pole up. At least I regen reasonably fast. Um, I don't think I meant to go down this way to get to the old worry. Maybe... Might just go up, but yeah, it's still very distant sands. I feel like it might be... Oh, I just feel like it's up. That's about the only feeling I've got for where it is. Oh, hey, there we go. It's right here. I probably don't need to drop anything. I'll drop my club, though. <laughs> Who needs a club? Right, anyway, let's go in. Oh, bog mummies. Um... Sure. Don't they do, like, cold damage or something? They got throw frost. You gotta be a bit careful. I mean, I do kill them nice and quick, thankfully. Oh, crocodile zombies? 
Right, this is pulling out all the tough creatures. I might just go hide in this little room to get my health back. Oh, I might do it again. Uh, I wanted to move up. Oh, it slowed me. I mean, they're gonna fight. This one's slowed because I don't think I can wait it off. Could probably close that one. There we go. Get rid of the slow, finally. Get dragged into the middle of the room. Yeah, this is definitely tough. But at least I got a door that I can keep on closing on these guys. Uh, doesn't Undead Howler Monkey still howl? I don't think it does. Well, Zombie One. Some of the other Undead ones probably still do do their thing. Alright, I can identify... What if I even got models of this? Scroll? Scroll of noise? Hmm. I see. Uh, kind of, mm, I don't know about like opening those doors now, Mike. Oh, I just make sense to wander around to something. Ah, oh, this guy's dragging me all over the place. I think I'm fine though now. Don't have two guys attacking me. Oh, what is that? There's a uh, bull python. That's fine. It looks kind of like a wooden mark because it's not big. I think they might share a sprite or something. But it's less dangerous in one way. Less dangerous. I don't think moving back there actually really helped, but oh well. There's another group of items. So I've got another identifier that I can use on... I got some potions now at least. I got some magic potions. For all the spell casting that I'm going to be doing as a troll. Or maybe later. We'll see. Uh, auto explore. I don't think there's anything else left of this place. Alright. Oh, nothing on the floor. Nothing at all. Yeah, okay. It's funny how it doesn't even bring up a menu and there's no items. It's just like, nope, there's nothing. Oh, an ogre again. I've got a bit more health now. Can I do my one with the tags yet? I th uh, yeah, I can. Not that it helps with this ogre. It's just checking. Hmm. Nah, I'm burning it's not doing anything. Ooh, I think I missed my lunge. Ow. Ooh, and it's still up to me. Okay, gotta ice blast it. That was kind of sketchy, and now there's another guy. I'll just move back and get my health back with this guy. In fact, I can probably just make it follow me around this pillar until I got my health back. So thankfully, as a troll, it does not take too long. Uh, I got Blink, okay. Oh, I got e a G with a Charming, which I think is a fatally confusion. So the Spectral Club, which I didn't notice that was Spectral, I would have brought it back if I didn't notice, instead of trying to run forts where her Spectral Club could actually hit me. I was funny getting that guy with a lunge attack and just like killing it outright. That's always fun. Yeah, I did the same with that. I mean, that was just a little quark of itself. Got a little lunge attack on it. It's good to uh, get something out of Wooji in here. Because I don't think you get a huge amount early on until you get the serpent slash going. Uh... I'm going to be a bit careful Karoj. Most of my damage up to all 23, so if I go Karoj, at least I'll still be able to do damage. Even if, um... I wouldn't be able to survive, because I don't have armor class, so at the moment, really, I've got, what, four? I haven't found a cloak, although I've got crazy youth lined up for later on. What is this? Enlightenment. I feel like willpower is something I'm doing pretty well with. Oh, I can't use the buckler. And there's two small fields. So there's large rocks in here. Who's it guarded by? Daggers goes 9 damage, 50 health. Wait, I got way more health than that. What's that like armor class and stuff? I've got way more damage as well. They don't have much armor class, a little bit of evasion. Hold on, that ghost looks trivial. Unless I'm mistaken. I think I left it. Oh, once I did leave an exclusion. 
Oh, they just have a red background that looks like, like an explosion. Yeah, that was fine. Now I've got my large rocks. Eight large rocks. That's a good find. Um, what stage do I get skill of those? Maybe now? I like eight skill, I think. Oh, there's a serpent talisman there, which would stop me throwing. Um, but it might keep me going on the way to getting a better talisman, because I got the statue one. I haven't got any skill just yet. I don't know. Um, it's probably not worth it with the... Maybe. Hold on, I might actually stop that throwing for a little while and think about trying to get a fairly early talisman, because having a... I think a statue on go going into the lair would be amazing, but I don't think I'm going to do that. You might be able to get it going at the end of lair if you're, like, really focused on it. I think I've done that before. So what did I get this time? I got, I can do airborne attacks. I always forget about the wall jump. In theory, it's decent, but it takes, like, a couple of tons, I think, to pull off. Um, you got to be a little bit careful with it. Oh, this guy draining. Oh, yeah. Oh, my police all back to the staircase, but these are all just little guys. It's more about if someone else comes along at the same time. Um, I don't need a ring of fire, but I'll keep one. If there's something that does fire damage, I mean, sure, I'll take it, I guess. Well, I'll put it on. So I got magic potion and a random scroll. I wasn't saving my money up for anything, so I might just grab this random scroll. Uh, there's also Trevor Stones. Unfortunately, with Trevor Stones, they work best when you have a bit of armor class, because otherwise you damage yourself. Um, I think they are they. I think they triple take armor class, but like a lot of the earth things. So, yeah, having a bird is definitely useful. Putting on this fire rig is not a bad idea when I'm going to end up in the middle of some steam here. Okay. I might swap back to my willpower though, so I'm not risking something coming along with some cold damage. All right, what else have we got? Oh, not too much stuff here. Although I'm sure there was one more. There it is. It just wandered off. Didn't want to fight me or something. Maybe we should have been staying, like, one behind that staircase or something so I could, uh, when I dashed forwards, I'd end up on it, but it doesn't really matter. All right, so let's go down. Um, I'm tempted to go back for that cloak of crazy youth. I feel like definitely tough enough at the moment. You know what, let's do it. So what level is crazy youth? So what's Dungeon 3? Yeah, I think so. Uh, where is he hanging out? Right there. All right, plus zero cloak of uh, willpower. I don't think I can charge it or anything just yet, but it's still an extra armor class. Um, and oh, that's not right. And an extra willpower as well, I guess. Although that brings me up to what two willpower? There's another ring of willpower here. I probably can't even get confused by an orc wizard. One percent. I mean, technically, I can get confused. It's just extremely unlikely. I'm not even wearing poison resist. Poison resist is definitely better than willpower, and I've got so much of it. Oh, hey, priest. Um, don't know what this book is. It's a good old book of my light gateway summon horrible things. It's what you like to see as a summoner. That and the uh, one with dragons called, like the book of the dragon or something. I'm gonna have more talisman. Uh, what is my armor? It's just like a robe or something. 
I don't know, I can always go with a mortality spike because I don't think I've seen anything that I can wear in terms of armor. No, I haven't. And it doesn't meld the cloak or anything, which I guess is something. Um, how much shape jumping do I need for one? It's a nine, eight? I don't know. Let me go check. Oh, ten. Sure. I gotta give it a try. Um, see if one of those is worthwhile. Either the more one or the snake one or eventually the statue one will be worthwhile. But that needs a little bit more skill. Although it doesn't need that much more. You can totally use it with like 14 skill. Or something like even 12. You don't mind having a little bit less max health. I don't know. Am I not as a troll? And what am I on? Dungeon level 9. So I'm getting reasonably close to heading into the lair, which is probably right there. Uh, let's go back to the staircase. I can bring something upstairs, like a yak or something. Got a ring of magical power. I don't think I've got a reason to wear that, do I? I don't think so. Alright, let's go back to the staircase. Oh, one of these will beat us, uh, beat, uh, beat the other to me, is what I'm trying to say. It didn't work that very well, though. Okay, I've got three in the shape shifting. That's actually a lot of guys. I might just move back. And then I might go down another way. Zero percent is it, or one percent, or what is it? Two percent. Old two percent chance of petrifying me. That's unlikely to ruin my day, but it could. Man, I don't imagine dying to like a one or two percent chance thing. I mean, it must have happened to someone getting petrified at two percent chance and then dying. Alright, what have we got? Oh, Jig Spy, Deportation, Alice's Intoxication. I mean, I might as well just grab the Deportation, even if it's probably not that good. Oh, that's some Enchant Armor. I... I'll put it on my cloak, right? Or... Wait, what does the statue for melt again? Um, it melts my... Body Armor, Gloves, and Boots. Yeah, okay. Let's put this on my cloak. I need all the armor class I can get as a troll to get that statue form going. Should I just see that say five on shape shifting? Sure. Uh... Oh, there's multiple gags. Well, I guess it's all good experience. Got me up to six shape shifting. Okay. Back up a little. Uh, at least into this corridor, I think. It's fun one hitting those whites just with a lunge attack, so they can't really do anything. Uh, well, that was a convenient staircase. Save me walking back to one of the other ones, at least. Um, can I just fight these yaks in the corridor? Gotta give it a try, although I should probably go up now, I guess, and just go down somewhere else. Alright, eight shape shifting. Something that went invisible there? What was that? Oh, no quiz it. Okay, that's fine. I can deal with one of those. Uh, so all the bees, I do have poison resistance, might be fine. Do I have anything else that can help out with these bees? Like a javelin or something? I don't think so. It should be fine with the poison resist. Do I have a healing potion if I need one? 
Let's just sub and slash this guy, because that's guaranteed to hit. All right. Oh, it'll get attacked, so we can going to pull up, but... I do kind of want to be back at the staircase. Um... What's that guy throwing at me? Poison darts, that's probably fine. I do have the poison resist, it's not too bad. Does it have a shield? No shields for me. That's a, this is a thing I do need at some stage. Okay. Oh, I can't really light it up with a large attack or anything. Could wear its armor and I probably should, but I might just... Wait, what's up with this guy? Charming, okay. That's probably fine, I've got the willpower. I might just get it out of there though. Oh, nine in the shape shifting? Um, sure. It's a shame we're going to be wearing the acid dragon armor now because uh, not going to get to wear it for very long. Uh, what's up with this guy again? Was this a charming dude? Yeah, good. And now I can go grab the acid dragon scales. I'll put them on. So I got seven armor class. Oh, I got 11 armor class. Sure. That means the more tellings, but maybe not the best anymore. I might just have to wait for the statue form. Um, oh, Jeremiah. Uh, where's a good spot to fight him? I might just bring this other dude back to a staircase. Oh, what's that guy? Is that an old wizard? I think so. Drop me with a magic dart. Oh, yeah, it's an old wizard. Oh, where's Jeremiah gone? Did he not notice me? I... Hmm, I guess not. Try to bring him around the corner so I can uh, slash him. Ow. Oh, got out of the butterflies before I got up to him. Yeah, what I like to do is hide around these corners so I can... Uh, no, that one though. So when he comes around, I can just move up to him, but he's doing a good job of blinking away this time around. Oh, uh, there we go. Oh. He's doing a very good job of blinking away, which is a bit of a problem because he's got all these butterflies, uh, which makes him really hard to get to. Uh, well, this is all up anyway. All of mayhem. I don't think that does a lot for him. I think he has to. Does he have to kill something to send other things berserk with that one? I don't know. Something like that. Wait, no, it's not of. No, a lot of rest is you berserk. Yeah, but an all of mayhem sends other people berserk or frenzied, actually, I think. Um, I might just bring the shape shifting up to 12. I mean, I will look at the serpent spot. Does it tell me my armor class was an odd? I'm not sure it does. Might still be worthwhile. So I've currently got 30 damage. If I turn into a serpent, get a little bit more health, I lose 3 armor class, I go to 34 damage. And I lose the ability to throw. That doesn't seem that worthwhile, honestly. I thought that statue form was probably not quite there, but I'll take a look at it. Let's see. It's, uh... Pretty on beyond 50% health, so, like, 50 health? That's, nah, that's not gonna work. I need at least 70%, I think, of that one. Yeah, that one Ah, oh, Sue's gonna pull up, but it's probably fine. Maybe? Could sub and slash away, but uh, not yet. That was a priest, I might just back up. Uh, might back up all the way to that staircase. There we go, get my health back. There you go, kill the priest, excellent. There's probably the orcish mines or something on this level, because there's enough orcs coming along. Uh, no, the priest, sure. 
Yeah, there we go. There's the Orcus Mines. I get some more boomerangs to help me with my throwing. Although I think I wasn't exactly short on throwing items this game. Because um, I got the tall, large rocks as well. That's got a wonderful thing, huh? And it hadn't noticed, man. Not sure where it's gone, though, now. Who knows? It could be anywhere at this point. Alright, well, presumably those are the last of my orders. Yeah, they are, because this is dungeon level 10. I mean, there might be, like, another order somewhere on the level, but... I should have all the normal god altars by now. Hey, this is the one of Warping, dude. Oh, the... Blinked? It died somewhere. I see the one of Warping. Is that it? No, it's one of Charming. Where did I leave the one of Warping? There it is. <laughs> Alright, one more level of dungeon, then I'm going into the... Oh, uh, not the Orcish Mines, that's the wrong one, the lair. Uh... I don't have an amulet yet, so that amulet on the ground's probably better than nothing. Oh, maybe a corridor's the best, I might just go up. Because I want to be able to surf and slash that guy if I need to. Which I didn't need to, but I still wanted to be able to. We got light, we got, oh, magic regen. Well, it could have been good. I'll put it on anyway. I don't think I'll be needing the magic points. Because it doesn't come with any spirit guarding or anything to actually make that useful. Uh, I didn't need to serve and slash. Good. Oh, hey, Erica. She's got a flaming scimitar. Um. Just poison damage. I think if I stop and slash it, this might go fine. Yeah, there we go. That certainly went fine. And do I... Oh, she's got a ring of decks. Um, what exactly am I using right now? I'm using willpower poison resist. I don't know if a dex would be that helpful unless I can get myself a shield, which I can't. Alright. Oh. Skeletal Warrior. Uh. How much health does that have? It's mainly about the armor class, right? Because it's got three posts of armor class. It does 32 damage. It's got 65 health. I remember those guys being quite tough at this point in the game. Um. The real question is do I try and fight it? I guess so. Do I surf and slash away from it? Or do I surf and slash fight it? Hmm, I think I surf and slash fight once and then run away. Oh, it's dead. Good. Yeah, I'm gonna get some more shape shifting. I'm going quite heavily into that. Um, all right, there we go. And let's see. So if I put on a statue form, I end up with seventy-eight percent health. I mean, that's good enough for me. Let's give it a try. Let's end up with twenty-five armor class. I do slow down, which is maybe a little bit of a problem, but we'll see. No, oh, these dudes. Um, yeah, that's the problem with being slow. Oh, there's a lot of them. I might have to teleport out. We'll see. Oh, maybe not. I guess the statue form helps enough that I can just go fight them all. Uh, what have we got? We've got three scrolls of one type. I've probably identified those. That's my biggest stack. Three scrolls of poison. Uh, wait, Curari? That's fine. Pretty sure I'm mute points. Wait, what did it do to hit me with a water warping? Must have been. Yep. Yep. Uh, yep. Okay. I could throw rocks. Uh, I didn't get much throwing skill. There's a ring of ice. I should get. Drop the magical power. That's not that useful. Oh, I don't need the poison resist anymore. In fact, I could probably just put this ice on unless. 
No, nah, both powers probably not really that needed. So yeah, let's just put the ice on. Uh, I do want the Curari so I can drop. Oh, the buckler, of course. That was never going to be useful with a troll. Like, I don't think you can even go to a form and be able to use it. I don't think that's going to work. All right. Uh, can we go with the shape-shifting, but I should get some throwing soon. Huh. It's probably about the closest I can get to a corridor. Um... Right. I might do a little bit of Serpent Slash. Finish these guys off just a little bit faster because a uh, Komodo Dragon can be dangerous. Oh, hold on. Do I want an Orb of Light? It would give me more accuracy, uh, but I'd lose my little bonus attacks. I mean, it's honestly probably worth it. It doesn't require any skill to use either, so yeah. I can get to it without being constantly ambushed by guys. It does mean I can't go invisible, but I don't think I've even gotten the invisibility potion, so probably fine. Oh, hey, Marjorie. She does fire damage, right, with a bolt of fire. She also has a wand of warping, which is not what I want to say at all. Um, and I'm instantly mesmerized, but I can break that. Got to put her in close. Uh, put on a ring of fire. Is that a call for this, I guess? Okay. A serpent slasher. Right, this looks like it's going just fine with her dead. I should, of course, remember to swap back the resistor. So it would mean a right rank with minus call resist or something. Uh, I do want the javelin, as it turns out. Not that I'm uh, any good with throwing it. I'll drop the poison resistance. I'm not going to need that. I should probably also drop the acid dragon now, but I think I have to unmeld it before I can drop it. Yeah, it's melted to my body. Sometimes a little mildly frustrating. You can't just drop it anyway. Um, I can identify something. I've got... Oh, pretty much yeah, I think this will... Oh, two requirements. Two requirements. Okay. Okay. Uh -huh. I want to read those pretty soon. They could have some good jewelry, but I might hold off until I've got, like... Uh, five to ten shield value? Don't really need to, but it... I... What else do I need? Like, I don't need a weapon. I do need jewelry. What else could it offer me? Um, I could offer a talisman, I guess, because I think they do now, but I don't really need another one of those. Yeah, I mean, it's mainly just jewelry I need. Uh, I think I'll stay where I am. All right, let's do another scroll. So I've got some, ooh, some blinking. It's all the good scrolls now. No, no, it's worth getting another point in shape if you think. Oh, uh, Leonoma. Okay. Can I pull it back from the trees? There we go. No, like, a heal itself up all the time. So I'm sure it'd be too bad. I will need fire just before I go in there, but I've got plenty of time to get some. Oh, and I got snake piss, which also wouldn't mind a little bit of fire just. And we've got a rig of... Ooh, slaying. I've got... I can probably take off the willpower thing by Cloaker's willpower and just put on a slaying. It's not that much more damage, but it is a good... I don't know. 9 or 10% or something. Uh, I'll do another scroll. Those are still the things that got stacked off, so I got cause fear. I don't know, maybe I should just read those, like, uh, those requirements now, but I just want to get like 5 shield value first. To encourage it to give me a town shield. I think it's a 
troll would kind of give Buckler so it's a bit more likely on town. She lost a minus conference in circumstances, but gets like nine strands though, so. It, mm. I mean, it's just a certain tallies, but I got a statue once, so it's not worthwhile. It's not a guys, but it should be fine. All right, where's the where's the shields? I don't have a shield yet, unfortunately, so I won't be able to use the, the shield skill if I don't actually get gifted um a shield. Well, at least not for a little while. So I don't want to get too much. I think five's enough. Oh, hey, Gastronog. Uh, I'm gonna bring it back to here. We'll do. I think. Somewhere where I'm not surrounded by air, so we can't air strike me as effectively. Also, I'm pretty sure I can wear a hat. Um, oh, I gotta end my form, drop my armor, put my form back on, and now I can go pick up the hat. Kind of a silly process, but I guess it works. Can I wear a helmet as a troll? Pretty sure I can't. I don't think it would fit, so good that I got a hat. In fact, hats you often get off uniques, because there's, um, also... What's his name? The dude with the funny hat, Wiglaf. Or Joseph, I think, also could have a hat, but you only get one of those in any particular game, I think. Alright, shields are, like, good. So let's get some... Throwing to, like, 5. I won't get a huge amount. Unarmed to, like, 14, and fighting to 12, I think. Try and top up some of the skills I'm missing. But anyway, let's go acquire... I don't need a large tag of order. Hamlet of Reflection of Willpower is okay. Or there's money. I mean, the Hamlet's an upgrade of what I've got. I might pick it up. Because I just got the good old magic regen. Yeah, I mean, that's not quite a shield, but it is Reflection. So I should get a bit of shield value. Oh, the manual fighting... Oh, there's a, a Spirit Guardian Resist Electric Resist Poison. Unfortunately, there's a Resist I've already got off the statue form. Or oh, there's a plus two hat of two willpower resist corrosion. Oh, I might just take that hat. Yeah, I mean, that hat's actually pretty good. Willpower basically sorted for the rest of the game. I think I wasn't even wearing a willpower. I mean, actually, definitely sorted because I got it on the cloak, which I can well, maybe a bitch swap off. Got it on the outlet, and then I got two on my hat. That's a, um, some ridiculous willpower right now, but sure. We're on lair four, so not the final level of lair just yet. Funny how these guys are struggling to group up because they're not getting many chances with the whirlwind attacks so if they're dying too fast, which is definitely how you want it to be. Things dying too fast. Or they're dying too slow or something. Oh, that good old Wujian altar. Anyway, I might identify... It's got to be a scroll again. Revelations. Yeah, it's all for a prayer to our god. What's Wujian doing in the lair? I mean, I guess they're teaching the beasts to do some martial arts. Get a... I mean, you don't get pandas. What do you get? They can do martial arts in here. Some kung fu elephants or something. That would actually be kind of funny seeing like an elephant doing martial arts. Also kind of terrifying. Uh, it's got a rope of fire resist, which I don't need anymore because I'm doing statue form. But I would have if I wasn't, maybe, or do... No, probably not, even. But I wouldn't need as much armor class I could get if I wasn't doing statue form, which would have been my acid dragon armor. Alright, what, what does that mean I can't ex reach somewhere? Oh, there's a scroll here, I see. Am I done now? There we go. Now, now I'm done, and I can just go down again. Is that brilliance or something? It is brilliance. Oh well, it's Bombard, Servitor. I think I had a character, was it yesterday when I was Mage? No, it might be, the, it might be a little bit earlier than that. 
I know I played an Earth Mage recently. I just don't think it was my last character, was it? No, wait, Octopus Earth Elements. So that was my last character, I think. <laughs> All right. But it wasn't yesterday, it was the day before. I uh, don't need that cloak. I can go identify. I still got two of the scrolls and like now the potions really. So go fog. All right. I'll pull this death yank back. I can probably find a herd of death yanks, but I prefer not to. Hey, I can just go through the calcifying dust. <laughs> Being in statue form and all. That's a nice little advantage to be in statue form. Don't have to worry about all these cat of leapers, guys. That's a lot of death yanks, but I think it's fine. But I might just serpent slash these because they're in such a perfect spot. Look at that. Just everyone dies in one serpent slash. The reason my other ones are kind of a little wasted, but oh well. Uh, that's the cat of bleepers. There's always one like a little bit further into here, which I might serpent slash. But I've got all the piety that I could ever need at the moment. All right, let's identify... Still no potions, so I might as well do the vulnerability there. I don't think I need any of this stuff. Basic cloak, stuff, death. Nah, that doesn't help me out. Oh, the good old Jeeva ult. I haven't done a Jeeva troll in a while, but this character had no plans to be Jeeva. What did I do? I think I left... No, no, did I finish such a level 11? I did. Hey, Sonya. She's, oh, she does have the storage. Do I have Polymorph or... Got Charming. Might be able to have a friendly Sonya. Yeah, maybe not. I tried a couple of times, but oh well. I think it was only like 60% or something. Anyway, what have we got? Summoning. Good old summoning. Let's hopefully not accidentally waste what I think I did on a previous character. Oh, hey, Snork. She usually goes bizarre. She hasn't yet. Maybe not. Today, anyway. Uh, I could do, like, warping, I guess. Oh, did she hit me? She did, too. She had a chance of sending me to the abyss of that one. I might do an ice blast on her. Yeah, because I don't want to go to the Abyss. This character's doing way too well to be sent to the Abyss. Because I would not have a very good chance of surviving. Okay. This is fine. Everything's fine here. Got Nigel next to me, which was the important part there. Because otherwise she just sits back and gives them something. Oh, it's a draining rape here. Plus nine with two decks on it. I mean, I feel like I never really need the draining because you've got a... Oh, wait, no, draining. Draining's a decent one. I think of uh, Pain or something. Stagger's Ghost, the Cognan Hunter. They used to do a lot of Spring Hunters. Apparently, they're doing Cognan Hunters at the moment. They don't look too bad, though. Got less health than me. They do, like, 18... No, no, 16 damage plus a little bit. Don't know what this thing is. Uh, I think this is fine. Hey, how's that little spirit guy getting trapped behind there? That's kind of funny. Anyway, now that they're both out, they should do a sub and slash. There we go. They can check out the cloaked stealth. I could. I mean, I got like endless willpower, so I actually. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, I could. Sure. <laughs> Let's give it a try, because I, I do actually have a little bit of stealth. Brings me up to. Wait. I thought I had one bit of stealth before I put it on. How do I still? I don't understand. Anyway, there's a protection rig, an evocations manual, a death talisman. Ooh, choices. Um, do I want a death talisman? <laughs> I actually kind of do. I mean, it's so long until I'll be able to actually use a death talisman, but I think I want one for later on once I go into extend or something. Oh, wave of frost. Um, I do have a revelations. I might just pop that one. 
a long way away. It's not. But if I take another staircase, I could probably bring it in closer. Not that one. <laughs> the other one's still pretty close, so. Uh, gotta go up this way. Yeah, it's not too far away anymore, at least. But we'll see what creatures I come along across. Quite a few things, don't all the- oh, the invisible one's just a vampire? That's probably fine. I get that dude to split up. Um, I thought I don't like these barbs, but I guess they do a sub and slash up to these guys. I will take some barbs damage, unfortunately. There we go, it's splitting up again, which is great. Oh, not a melee, eh? I guess I can zap it with a... Uh, I don't think a light would... Oh, 70% hurt, it's not bad. Uh... Dude's gonna need some fire resist so I can take off. I might leave on the cold resist just in case something comes along and just take off the slaying. Alright. So I'm reasonably close to an ice cave, so who knows what will come along. Fate correctly, I think I've got time to get to this. And I do need to clear out some inventory space because my inventory is very full. I don't need the willpower reg, definitely not. Um, it's all those throwing items, I think. Also, I've got the noise. I can't really need the brilliance. I might also leave the... Nah, I'll leave the deck out here. Um, but I might also leave... The acquirement and the enchant arm outside. I got a cold resist, right? Yeah, I've got one cold resist. Oh. Constricted. Hmm. Oh, I guess that's fine. What have we got? I got a book of sticky flame. If you want to really kill the simulacrums, just put some flame on them. I don't feel like sticky flame is a spell I've used much, and I have played a few alchemists, which I think happened in their starter book. I don't know what's going on with that. Anyway, let's identify... Oh, now I've got some potions. Four potions of haste. Excellent. I think I can actually buy, like, a potion of haste. So that would have been another one way of identifying those. But, oh, well. Hey, Malcolm Rose. How's it going? How's your streak going? I don't know if you not played Crawl recently. Are you going pretty good? Excellent. Can this guy get over the water? Scythe draw card. Oh, you finished your game number 70 uh, last night, actually. Nice. That was with uh, streak number 70, I guess it is. Yo, that streak's getting pretty long. I'm actually currently on the streak, but it's like not even 10% of the way to that streak yet. Oh, a guy wants uh, you to make or oh, keep going until you lose the streak. I mean, with this streak, you never really know. That could be, like, next game, or you could go a hundred more games. You really can't tell. So he's been uh, do or donating to make it happen. <laughs> I'm actually kind of curious, like, how long that streak is going to go on as well. Because, like, a lot of the, I think, players with long or longish streaks are, like, on an active streak and haven't continued for ages. <laughs> I'm really curious, like, how far someone could actually get if they just kept on playing. Also, do I want this shield? I kind of do. Got a little bit of skill already. I gotta put it on. Cold resistance here is pretty good. 1.2 attack delay. I don't think that's too bad. Oh, you got a D3 Sentinel with, like, an acid one to strike at any moment? Can Sentinels have acid ones? They probably can, honestly. No, the D3 Sandals could definitely strike at any moment. Oh, well, if the player never makes a mistake, it could be indefinite until RG gets you. Yeah. I feel like there are, like, the occasional unwinnable games, but maybe... Maybe not. 
Oh, do I need an ice magic? Not really, but I'll take a gravitamperine. Gravitamperines are so good. I literally love them. Just like pulling all the enemies away from you. Maybe not so good when you can't just run away, but still. I've always found those ones really fun. At least twice during your streak, you ran to early game centaurs with acid mods. It was horrifying. Wow, okay. I guess they, they do exist then. Can any creature have a wand, or is it just uh, human intelligence ones? I haven't really looked at, like, the code or anything for determining if an enemy has a wand. Oh, anything with hands can use a wand. Oh, that makes sense. That does make sense. Um, all right, well, I think I'm done here. I haven't really looked at the loot, actually. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, that was worthwhile. It could be a shield. Oh, where's this corrosion? And there's a... Uh... the best thing to do... With... Oh, it didn't even notice me. I do have, like, a, little go a good little corner to hide around there with that center, at least. Shield's more cold resist, I do believe. Ooh. Uh... Which of these is the closest? That one, right? Wow, well, right. Throwing the, oh, right. The, the rocks thrown slow by the statue form. I mean, they're quite slow. Uh, don't I give trolls heads as, uh, as well? Not trolls. These guys. Kind of tried stuff and slash them, but I'm kind of worried that I give them heads. Yeah, okay, I blew them up, but they weren't getting heads. So it's just a good thing that I do so much damage on each attack. I guess statue form is not bad for killing them because it makes each attack do more damage. Um, but it's still kind of sketchy. I can't believe it, so I'm not too worried about that one. It feels weird not having to worry about those ones. Um, I guess I still do do some damage in melee, but... With 30, uh, 32 armor class, it's not too bad. What is it? What is that? Deep Elf Pyromancer? Where? Oh, there it is. Uh, Josephine has, like, the ghostly fireball, but I think I'm... Oh, ha! I'm pressing all the wrong buttons here. What does it do? She's got Vampiric Draining. I mean, these are all fine. The spell is not going to do anything because I'm not undead. Uh... That's a good spot for the Servant Slash, I think. So why is my intelligence so high right now? I guess I must have put on something to give me a bit of intelligence. There we go. Thank got rid of all those guys. Oh, your last game was actually a troll shapeshifter. Troll shapeshifters are really fun. I don't know, they, uh, I'm, I'm not sure about the start of a shapeshifter because I'm not sure it helps you too much, but... Hey, when I did a troll shapeshifter, I remember it being fun. I oh, bet you found some gold dragon armor early due to Oka's gifts. He didn't do any shapeshifting. Yeah, fair enough. No, I mean, the eventual plan with this character is to go with, like, gold dragon armor eventually. Oh, you get a plus, like, plus one unarmed from beast form, you guess? The beast form, what does it give? I mean, I guess it gives you, like, a little bit of slaying. Yeah, I guess so. Oh. Where's a good place to go? I mean, this invisible guy is probably not going to do too much. Yeah, we can't get rid of it. But that's what I need to be using my orb of light or something. Uh... I got enough willpower. They don't. Ah, uh, yeah, zero percent of the agony. Good. So there's not much you can do about like it reflecting injuries. Oh, it's actually doing quite a bit with that. But. I don't think there was any way I could, like, not attack it, because I, I just attack on moves, so... Yeah, well, I guess... It, mm. It's kind of like that a lot of times with those guys. You have to attack them anyway, either, because they can torment you, or... That sort of thing. Could I just sit around here for a little while? Alright, the reflection's doing a pretty good job. 
I didn't want to be near the corner so I could pull the back of my knee into so I got rhyme blood. I had fun with some rhyme blood recently and, um, well, I don't know if it was recently, but I had some fun with some... Oh, I forgot my items here. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> At least it was I didn't need in a hurry. But I had some fun with that um, in a... What was it? It was fighting the royal jelly, I think, and I... I know I had another spell as well, but I put down rhyme blood. What else did I put on top of it? And then the royal jelly just died. I can't even remember. But the right right spreading to the adjacent guys was doing a lot. I just needed something to start it. Um, wait, did I get resist corrosion from something? I did from my hat. Okay. I thought I did. Anyway, I should totally do the orchestra mines and not forget that one. Okay. Maybe more guys than I should have pulled up. Uh, wall jump seems sketchy. I think the right thing to do is get out a um, whopping. Oh, this but the situation. Yeah, it's a little bit such, uh, sketchy situation. I think it's got a whopping. Oh, okay, that worked. And then I can do a sub and slash. Okay. Uh -huh. Um, I might just grab a tambourine, this guy. He says it doesn't line me up for another one of my attacks, so I might just zap with a wand of light a couple of times till it's dead. There we go. Oh, how fast do we attack in statue for? Pretty slow. 1.2 attack delay. So yeah, not exactly speedy with our attacks. Oh, you saw a 1.1 in there as well? 1.5 with my move delay. Uh, it's hard to test because so many of my attacks are actually just moves. Oh, you're definitely trying to get uh, faster. Yeah, I should. What am I getting? Shields. Probably about time I turn the unarmed um, back on. Yeah, it looks like the fighting's... Uh, I might have turned that one back on as well. Oh, she also can do that. I uh, don't know how much it's slowing me. Oh, I guess it's slowing me a bit. <laughs> I mean, these guys aren't too bad. They're going to die to their own bolts. Which is a good thing, because I can't even get up to them, because they keep on stepping back, and I'm so slow. Uh, I need some fire resist instead of slaying. Oh, there's Asriel, isn't there? There's got to be Asriel down here. Question is where? There he is. He's mainly actually dangerous with his damnation. Oh, he did get me with his damnation. Guess he doesn't care about hitting himself. He's probably immune to it. Yeah, usually you have to use his creatures to stop him getting damnation, I think. Oh, maybe not with a medium shield. Does it say it's a target penalty if I get, um, look at it? Uh, it reduces my evasion by 0.7. So it would be 0 0.07 reduction to my attack delay, I guess. Doesn't actually that bad. Yes, I definitely need more unarmed skill to bring that attack delay down. Am I still wearing that wand of, uh, not wand of flame, that ring of fire? I think it's probably still the right thing to have on. Because I know there's all, like, the sorcerers and stuff in here. Uh, apparently also a bunch of, like, high priests and normal priests. Gotta be, don't want to move out too much here, because I know there's going to be more priests. In fact, there are, in fact, a ton more priests here. That kind of gives me an, oh, an idea of what sort of ending I've got here. It's one of the ones that tries to surround you with priests. Oh, I thought you'd have a tower shield. It'd be nice to have a tower shield. I certainly wouldn't mind one. But no, not yet. Yeah, with a tower shield, I'd probably have noticeable um, penalty. I want to move up, but... Huh. Hmm. Could I just move forwards and then teleport out if I have to? 
is getting back is kind of sketchy. Ugh, didn't kill. I think I should start the teleport. Oh, that was so quick because it costs slow move delay. Right. I'll probably just end up going straight back into that situation, but at least... Oh, I didn't even get rid of the High Priest today. So the most important ones to get rid of. Oh, well. Maybe I'll be able to pull one back out or something. Oh, was that a roll shot? At least I got willpower. Yeah, I think I've got enough that she can't banish me. I've still got my fire resist on, so I should be completely fine. Good, I hope that's one of the high priests that was hiding out in the, um... In the area. Oh, and the Croxic again. Gotta seven slash this guy. I think I managed to avoid it. I think too bad for the high priest at least. I'll run up to the priest, I guess. Uh, and I thought that kind of actually worked so it's uh, weird here, yeah, just like running past all the other things because they take damage on the way past. Alright, what have we got? Just an armor shop. Unlikely to be anything. Yeah, nothing. Doesn't really need to fire resist. Oh, heal wounds. Um, Identify is probably still useful. What else have we got? Poison. I don't need the scimitar. Or oh, fog's useful. Metallic purple potion, maybe. I'll definitely buy it. Okay. Oh, cancellation? How much money have I got? 2,000? I could probably just buy most of the stuff. Uh, I don't know if I need the enlightenment. Probably not. Because my willpower is good and I've got like a ring of flight somewhere. Oh, Mason Flails? That's not the most useful, is it? I don't think I'll ever use Mason Flails. I'm pretty sure I'm going to be unarmed all the way. Actually, before I read that identifier, I should go buy some of these unidentified things. I'm going to buy... I'll buy a Berserk Rage just to get it identified. There we go. Um... And now I could go read the identifier of whatever I've got. Yes, yeah, so I've got some sharp weapon. I uh, glad that's an inventory spot, which I do need because I got all these like items on the ground that I can't pick up here. And I've got torment. That's like mildly useful in savage form. It's like it's not completely useless. Uh, I don't think I need any of those other things. Excellent. What's the book of battle for? That was like an eventual thing that I might eventually get if I want to get mad at for the salt. Whoa. I think I just go straight back down here. Oh, this dude. The Harold dude. There we go. I just want to go like net it up in the midst of all these dudes. I mean, it's fine now because they're all just like little orcs. Yeah, a little bit of my attack takes them out. Uh, I don't think there's too many priests. I think this should be fine when they go back down. Or up, whatever it is. I don't know. It, it like feels like a down staircase, but it's actually technically an up staircase. What have we got in here? Are they doable? We've got Lowiv... Lowiv? Oh, I can't even say that name. Lowiv's Ghost? They are Deep Elf Alchemists of Dismanos. They got Sticky Flame. Don't care about their Toxic Radiance. They might actually be doable. Sure. Let's go duel them. <laughs> Wait, I just like one hit them? Sure. I guess they were very much doable in that case. Uh, I had a couple of levels left on the dungeon, right? I've got dungeon level 14 and 15, I think. Oh. Hey, Louise. She looks fine. She can't banish me. I'll just... Oh, Jorgrad as well. I'll definitely go up. Jorgrad? Can Jorgrad at least rapid deconstruct me? Anyway, I finally got a tower shield. It uh, doesn't give any resist, though. I'm not sure I'll go with it yet, but I'll definitely think about it. If I put it on a game like... So, evasion, but it actually decreases my... Nah, it's not worth it yet. 
Uh, I'm having violent floods or something, so I might just type and slash jog run here. All right, well, I can identify whatever this is. D, Jed. I'll take jog run, I don't think I need just a heavy quarter stuff for beating people up. Nothing much else. Yeah, I'm like, I'm pretty sure he could. Oh, it's another unique. Rupert, they all hang out together. Uh, Rupert can berserk up, but I think he's fine. Oh, he's always dead. I'll just sub and slash him. There we go. I love how good sub and slashes are like finishing a lot of creatures off. Can I back up? I'll back up a little bit more because then I can have a prompt joke point with all these ugly things. All right, level 16. Um, what does this help? Do I can't wear it, right? It's a random slow one anyway, so it wouldn't even be that good if I could wear it. All right, what do you got? We got a uh, Sigatuma's Beautification. I still haven't got around to trying that one. I should have some stage. But I don't know if I want to do a Necromancer on a streak, because I always get those killed. Oh, maybe it would be fine, but I feel like I want to try and keep this streak going as long as I can. Because what is it, a four streak at the moment? I think it's a four streak. Actually, let me just go check on that. Yeah, it is a four streak. Uh, I can actually fly here. I'm not sure if there's any treasure headed on the other side or anything. There is, in fact, nothing. I know that some of those have treasure, but they're kind of really rare, I think, the ones that have treasure. All right, well, one more dungeon level, and then I'm ready for... All my branches, uh, snake pits, and swamp. Either I can do either. Kind of feeling like maybe the swab. Oh. This is okay. Mainly because the archers are gonna take themselves out. Otherwise, that could have been a little bit of an issue having that many archers against me. Yeah, I mean, this Amulet Reflection has been more useful than I thought, because it's usually not really that useful having Reflection until, like, Volts or something, in which case it's usually quite useful in Volts, but... Hey, I guess the extra shield value's been quite a big deal as well. Uh, what do we have here? I can identify Brand Weapon. Yeah, well, good luck bla branding up some claws. It'd be kind of strange if you could have, like, branded up claws and fists and stuff. Just go around with, like, flaming hands. That was an invisible guy here, isn't there? Yeah. There was one of the ogre mages, I think, just tagging in there, hasting the other ones up. All right, well, it's time for... I go to try the swamp, but the snake pits also doesn't sound too bad. Kind of do either. Oh, that's a decent chunk of guys. Either way, I'm going to be getting surrounded by a ton of creatures. Oh, hey, Roxanne. Oh, maybe I should have grabbed the invisibility potion. I don't know. It's a little bit of a risk either way. I could kill Roxanne, but like, I've already got a statue form, so what's the point, right? Because I'd probably have to spend like a lignification or something to do it. And then, I don't know, throw rocks or something. Or boomerangs, or... I don't think I've got many javelins. They're probably not javelins. 
Hey, it's another sub. It's one. It's another artifact sub. It's one. How many artifact sub and talismans do I have this game? Oh, maybe only the two artifact sub and talismans, but still, it's more than you generally get. How much of the levels wrong saying guarding? It don't think too much. I think you can just take the way down there. Because, I mean, if Roxanne was guarding enough of the level, they would at least give me a reason to do them. But otherwise, I don't think there is. Wait, what happened to the creatures there? Are those clouds made to summon creatures? I don't know. Maybe they just got unlucky on their roll or something and didn't roll any creatures. They got a ton of immolation, like 10 immolation. Yes, they got one fire resist. I totally could emulate some guys. Man, I'm glad the, like, deep water doesn't just, like, instantly kill you when you try and walk into it anymore. Like, I remember in old versions of the game, that was definitely a thing. I would have gotten this character killed already if that was a thing. <laughs> well, that was kind of a little bit silly when the game was like that, but at least uh, it got changed. I think it initially it got changed to, like, a warning. It's like, do you actually just want to die? And then it uh, got completely removed the ability to walk into the deep water. In fact, now if you get trapped over deep water, it's like uh, heavy draining, I think, each turn. Until you get off the deep water anyway. Which means there might actually be reasons you would want to step onto deep water now. Um... What is that thing? Shot strike zombie. It actually can't do a lot. Because it loses its, like, shot that it could do, um, if it wasn't a zombie. Alright, what do I need? My shape shifting's good. I get a little bit of evocation, but, like, I don't know, maybe not much. It's minus three aptitude. I could get... I mean, I think I just get better at clawing people, honestly. And a little bit more fighting, like, 15 or something. That's a good old captain's colors. If I wanted to disarm people, that's actually a really nice rapier. I've had, I've had at least one character using it, and it was pretty fun. I think I've had some other characters that didn't, like, really want to use it, but they just had it, so they used it. Oh, I can probably drop the amnesia. And I'm done with the second level of the swamp. Well, the swamp, yeah, I think the swamp was the right choice, although who knows, the snake pits might be also not too bad. Alright, level 17. I'm usually, I think, level 18 by the time I get my first rune. It seems fairly reliable, like, early on, the level you tend to be able to turn points of the game. And then a bit later on, it seems to vary a little bit. Like, the level you get the Zod or something varies by a few, but the, the level you tend to get your first rune always seems to be pretty similar. I mean, I guess there'd be, a, like, a little bit of variation. Um, I could actually ask the bot, because I think that's in chat. What would it be? Actually, yeah, what would it be? I guess it's, it's, it's X alpha level, right? Experience level. So... Did I do that right? That does not look right at all. I think that's doing that for someone for called Rune. Apparently it's a guy that plays this game called Rune or something. Um, oh wait, I didn't mean everyone, I meant me. What am I doing? My bot command's all wrong today. It's gonna take a while to chug away at that one, isn't it? Because I ask it uh, for everyone. Let's give it a real one, but it's gonna take a little while to start processing that. I don't think there's any way you can, like, cancel the bot. I think it just stops up to, like, a minute and a half of it can't complete, which it probably can. It wasn't too complex of a query. I don't think there's also any way to really tell if the bot's actually working on the command or not either. Uh...
Where did this friggin' go? There it is. Just flying around just out of range. Well, actually quite a bit out of range. Uh... Oh, it looks like I very severely killed my bot there, unfortunately. Uh, sure, I'll be back. Oh, there it goes. It's doing something. A 90 second limiting scene. Yup. And then it worked on the second one really quickly. So... Yeah, my most common- wait, I've got- actually my most common level for getting a rune is level 17? Really? Followed by level 18 and then like a few stragglers? Is that true? Huh. Hmm, that seems- that doesn't seem like what I was expecting, but sure. Cause wasn't there like a tournament banner for getting a rune by level 17 or something? Although I think it was only one of the lower tiers of a banner so you don't actually have to get it if you think win a game by level 21 or 2 or something. It might have been a higher level, might have been, I can't remember. Man, giving the Tyra so many heads, I don't think it uh, changes how much experience they give. You can't just give yourself lots of experience by giving all the Hydra's heads or something. I don't think that's how that works. Uh, can I get flayed? I don't think so, right? I probably should still servant slash some of these guys. Ooh. How many heads? Wait, five headed. Okay, I might just move here. There we go. Go to that five-headed simulacrum. I've had a character die to one of those simulacrums somewhat recently. And they were doing quite well. Then I got myself killed by a like, many-headed simulacrum. Um... I guess that level 17 thing's got to be correct. Because, I mean, this character could potentially get a rune at level 17. It's kind of funny that the tournament banner would be asking for like the most common level which I get a rune to be the one that you get a rune by. Oh, I'm marked. Probably fine. Oh, hey, it's a Linnaean Hydra. Uh... That's probably not fine. I'll do it. I'll do a cancellation because I got five of those and then I'll read a teleport. Alright, how do I deal with a Lunane Hydra? I know it's just a skeleton one, actually. How much damage does a skeleton one do? 14 on each attack, but it's got so many attacks. Um... I... I mean, it's not too bad, but I might just go do the snake bits. <laughs> then come back for that one. Because I've got everything I need to do the snake bits. I'll... I'm still going to try to get out of here. Uh, apparently not. Right, well, I better emulate these dudes, I guess. I still got my fire resist on. Good, good. Alright. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's definitely a nastier entrance than my entrance to the swamp, so I'm glad I did the swamp first. Well, most of the swamp first. Yeah, getting distracted could be a problem, but I don't have much um, evasion for it to lose. It's mainly about losing my ability to do things like sub and slash and that sort of thing. Hey, Nicola. Do I have a silence? Hmm, I don't think so. Sub and slash him. I just want to like, damage him fast. I know I'm resistant, but he can still do a lot of damage. You've got to be careful of him. Oh, it's another... You know, it's like the third granite talisman or something. Who doesn't want an entire collection of granite talismans? I'm mean, glad I got one really early. Um, yeah, it definitely helped a lot. Alright. Oh, also, I forgot to go buy the uh, resistance potion. It probably doesn't matter. There's also a Trevisodes I could go buy... Oh, huh, maybe we should go buy some of that stuff. Also, why is the... Why is the charge up and not an auto pick up? Oh, I know why, because I, I still haven't fixed the thing where I've got when I drop an item and take it off auto pick up. I think I should probably get rid of that. Yeah. 
because every time I like go into a trove or something, I end up accidentally taking something off auto pick up that I want to auto pick up. Or in that case, I was just going into an ice cave. I dropped some of the good items. But the charred armor is just for when I get a tower shield that I'm interested in. Which, there's a good chance that one of these snakes in here has one. Like, the Naga warriors tend to have them. So I think I'm gonna hold on to those and charred armor until the end of here. Oh, this guy got... Ah, it's a kite shield. Plus zero. I think mine's like plus two or something, which is the reason I'm using it over tower shield. Because it was... I mean, it was only slightly worse than the defense, but it was better than other things. Um, got the strength. Is that strength better than the slaying now? Oh, it doesn't really say much, does it? It tells me my evasion would change if I put it on. Um, I'm going to presume it is and just drop the slaying because my damage right now is 60, so almost certainly. Uh, yeah, okay, constricted. Oh, hey, Wigglaf, he's got a willpower hat on. But I've got more willpower. He's got two tags, it's probably not worth it. Um, I wish I could size them up. Oh, I can. Huh. Sure. I mean, I'll serve and slash him first. And then I think I'll silence him. So he just turns into a basic melee character, and he's not too bad, but he's a basic melee character. Alright. Yeah, I mean, I don't actually need a fancy hat. Does, does this hat always have the same sprite? Maybe it does. I'm sure there's a sprite I got on the last hat he had. Maybe there's just not that many artifact sprite hats, uh, hat sprites or something. Oh, that might be reflection, right? It's a tower shield of reflection, yeah. Because it's got the purple background, which, um, when you can see it's shield, it's often a shield of reflection. All right, well, that's, uh, kind of a bit unnecessary, though, with my amulet being reflection, but whatever. Oh, uh, right. Yep, I did get surrounded. I might. Uh, I mean, I might have to do some fear or something, but for now, I might just do a whopping. I might follow that up by a serpent slash. Oh, that did pretty well. Oh, I might do another whopping. It does probably more damage to them than it does to me anyway. Yeah. That was an awkward dispersal trap. Okay. It may sense of warping myself again. I think it does. I don't think it makes sense to try and grab a tambourine these guys. Um I don't think it makes sense to teleport just yet either. Oh, I didn't get myself with the whopping that time. Didn't last time either. Okay, let's give it another try. It does kind of start the building up around me at least. Oh, that's not too bad. Yeah, it kind of got me into a safe spot. Oh. Uh. I'll just throw a rocket at this guy. I know it's kind of slow. It's probably the last rocket I should throw. I don't really have the skill for that. Maybe I should have the boom rags equipped up or something. Because those are probably a little bit faster at throwing. Although with the statue form, they're still not going to be fast. Unfortunately. That's one of the main downsides with... Well, pretty much every form is how hard it makes throwing. At least with the statue form, you can still throw. It's not like uh, some of the other forms where you completely can't throw.
Uh, I want to get more whopping sure I actually do. I uh, don't really need those, to be honest. Oh, um... He's going to get teleported around me. Hmm, I see. Oh, actually not as bad as I thought. Also, I might just go emulate these dudes. I got like 15 emulation. Ah, uh, which cost doesn't work on this guy. Um... I don't know if emulating those guys made any sense. It doesn't seem to be the most effective because I was well, doing just much damage to myself, really, with the explosions. Alright, got four charred up. Is this another ghost that I can just fight? It's, uh, Ru Ruid's ghost. A Mountain Dwarf fighter. They do... Oh, that's a lot more damage. Uh, 38 damage plus 20 uh, electric. 140 health. They also look at that armor class. They just got armor class. Um, no, I feel like that one's a little bit tougher. I might have to wait a bit on that one. I mean, I could probably take them out, but I don't think it's like an easy kill like the previous ghosts have been. Right, is this the, pre the last level here? It probably is. Yeah, Snake Fist level 4. Hopefully this is the rune I can get. I don't think... I, I can't think of, like, off the top of my head something that would be too nasty for this character to do. Oh, considering to be already, but I'm still going to try and serve and slash. Like, when you do a Serpent Slash and it can't move, it doesn't spend a charge of the Serpent Slash, but it also doesn't move and it does spend the turn, so you do have to be careful with that sometimes. Like, if you needed the move to happen, it doesn't guarantee it. Um, now look at shields again. I'm sure I saw most of more tower shields. Oh, there's a plus zero tower shield, right. I see. Oh, really? Summoning in the... So we've got a Mysterium summoning in the Kaku Demon. Oh well, I guess I'll Serpent Slash. And another Kaku Demon straight away. Man, at least I didn't get Mob Mutated. At least I don't think I got Mob Mutated. Now those are just uh, sad you form mutations. You can even call them mutations because they kind of just innate statue form things. Uh, pull these guys back around this corner. Oh, wait. Is this going to sit there and shoot me? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. That's a lot of dudes. Uh... I don't know if this makes sense, but I think I'm going to do a heavily storm. Hopefully I don't get constrained or something. Uh, good. The guy that was haste, I think, died. I don't think this makes me immune to constriction, right? But it seems to... Uh, I don't know. It almost feels like it does, but I don't think it does. Yeah, I think that's probably all they're going to get to fight. Um, oh, there's another guy here, though. Maybe not. And there we go. That's my rune. So I basically just did the entire rune bolt in one go with my um, summon slash there. Right. Uh, let's check out shields again. So we've got the... Still got the plus zero tower shield of reflection. Oh, there's a protection shield there. Can I lose a cold resist? I wish I had a proper, like, ring of fire resist or something. Um, where are we going next? Ah, uh, wait, hold on. I might put on the strength ring instead of this protective fire ring, and then I'm gonna swap to the tower shield of reflection, see how that goes. So if I put it on, I gain three shield value, but I lose half the evasion. 
Yeah, whatever. But I think I'm going to enchant it up, so I effectively gain a bit of shield value. Yeah, well, it's a bit of a shame it's replied to, but it'll do, so... I don't think I need the flaming one anymore. I probably don't need the polymorph. That'll do. Let's go to the fold, see what they've got in store for me. You don't usually need too much fire resist. I might need to swap it on for some uniques. I kind of hoping to get like a proper fire resist source. Let's see. No, it's just like robes of resistance or whatever. All right. What do we want? I can get, I should get more shield value. Definitely. Oh, what's what I said that limit to? Oh, probably two or something. Silly. Uh, get some more unarmed. I think that's about it for now. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else that's like super urgent. And once I find gold dragon armor, I should get some armor skill and then go get the death form going, I think. Probably fine. Despite the fire damage they're doing. I think I've got a, a Quicksilver. What did I get? I got a light one, so I can't stop those guys recalling with Quicksilver. I mean, theoretically, I could do it with Polymorph, although I think I dropped down as well. Okay. What is Surf and Slash? I'm just trying to see... I don't know what a good spot is. I mean, I guess... This is a decent spot. Let's go do it. There we go. Oh, four escape edges all together? That's gotta be because some kind of fault. That's not something that would just naturally spawn like that. And no treasures? It's just random stuff? I thought it would be a, like a treasure one at first when I saw the random stuff. It's like, oh, there's probably treasure in each of those rooms. No, it's just someone's spare stuff. Alright, what's the weapon shop got? It's got a vampire candax, it's got boomerangs. If there was anything in there that was useful, it would probably be boomerangs. Um, uh, not massively tempted to go with the boomerangs. Man, this character's actually got a number of things he's gotta get going, because he's gotta get the death cell he's been going, he's gotta get some armor going. I was able to face, I don't think I'm actually short of party right now. And I'm doing incredibly well with Pliny because I haven't been doing that many heavily storms or something. I think it's the heavily storms that tends to take the most. Uh, I don't have any fire resist right now. I just grab a tambourine some of these guys. Right, there we go. Oh, the orange brain is doing doing the something as well. Um, I just no beating these guys up isn't working so well. I might have to get it with a wand of light. I think. There we go. I mean, that was uh, made it a lot easier once they just decided to stick stand next to me. Yo, what's up, K man? How's it going? How's your runs going today? I hope you're having some successful runs. And not, I don't know, dying on dungeon level 1 to the first creature you meet or something. That's always the worst runs. Oh, I might, um, I might have revelations. That's probably it, right up there. Yeah, I mean, that's the only portal the level has got to be, right? Sailing tolling death nearby, it's gotta be it. In fact, it is it. I've dropped the shield. Um I'm hoping this sells me some fire this. That would be nice. Do I I will eventually need the face because I'll probably use it to like swap around titles and stuff. 
But it's going to be a long time before I need that. I don't have any brilliance or anything left. Okay. Sure. Yeah, it's a little old going shopping. At least it doesn't seem to care about a statue troll running through. Oh, there's a face fire this tablet. That's a source of fire this. There's also... Oh, there's a death talisman in here. Hold up. Uh, yeah, I should buy it. It's cheaper um, than trying to get off my acquirement. Oh, there's a ring of fire protection in here. Um, I'll see what else is available, but that might be the might be the way to go there. Get my fire of this with that one. Oh, you got your first vine soaker win? Excellent. Oh, I think I saw that character in um Discord. That was the one with the Holy Wrath uh quick blade, right? Oh, you wanted to take him into extended, but he lost two vines because of the extended already. Yeah, I mean it makes sense. Just uh get the win at that point, right? I'm pretty sure I saw that one in Discord. Also, next one, you will do that. Just wanted to mark it off. Yeah, I mean, it would have been a good character for Extended, but uh, from what I saw of it, but, like, it's always a bit of a risk getting tormented to death or something. Ah, it's the robe. All right, well... How's my willpower going? Uh, pretty well, so I could lose my willpower. Is it worth getting a... Hmm... Gaining a fire to the pump or losing my reflection? Maybe not. Yeah, I'll definitely get that one. I might grab it anyway. I'm just not sure if I'll put it on. I don't know. It seems a little questionable. Let's put on the fire resist instead of... Wait, can I do it instead of cold resist or... No, that's probably a bad idea. I might do it instead of strength. Because they got to have at least one cold resist in the, um, in the vaults. Otherwise, I'll get frozen to death when the walls get frozen type thing. Yeah, you don't need to fly. Let's get out of here. But no, that character looked like they were doing pretty well with the... What did you have? You had, like, the Gauntlets of War, right? Giving you plus five slaying, and then you're using a Quick Blade with it. I know the Vice Hookers of Quick Blade are good, especially if you can stack on a little bit of slaying. Uh... Oh, you got that on Zod 3, so I guess it was just kind of a an end game thing to make your Zod easier. Jamie didn't have it like uh, throughout a lot of the game. Did Blood Raid and Zod 5? Yeah, it definitely would. No, that was uh, looking pretty good. No, I feel like what was the. I mean, the speed run, the highest speed run was a bit different because it was using like a uh, Mountain Dwarf, but that had like the Golders of War for the extra slaying. And then I think it had a speed weapon like a. Uh... What's it called? The, the axe, Iger or something. The speed, broad axe. So they ended up sort of fast attacking weapon with all this Godless of War. is really powerful. A haunted infestation. Alright. Not spells this character will get, though. Not unless I somehow... Oh, I actually got 30 then. It's not terrible. Hmm. I like how this guy's buffed. I might just... Uh, I think I'll just sub and slash it. There we go. Get rid of it before it like makes me fragile or something. What else a hand cannon that guy had? It looked like it. Oh yeah, it's a plus zero hand cannon. I recognize the bottle, but I like how they got their own bolt because they used it to shoot arrows, which was kind of strange. Didn't make a lot of sense. Oh yeah, I gave you your first win a couple of years ago. No, it's uh, definitely that's a really good axe. <laughs> I think I have got to use it a number of times. I can't remember how many times. I don't know how you query that with the bot. It probably is somewhere to like query if you're wielding Argon, which if I won with it, I'd almost certainly be wielding it on the end. Oh, two flaws? Alright. I don't think I have magic map. I think I just peacefully continue. Oh good, the Crystal Guardian died. I was so ready to serve and slash it though, at any second there. I think I always could have started with one anyway. Oh, this is... Oh, I should have gone take that staircase. It doesn't matter. I'll just go kill these guys and then go take the staircase.
And then there's a way straight back up to where I'm meant to be exploring, except for that's... I always seem to get shafted. Well, not always, but often I get shafted when I'm almost done with a level. Like that one, there's no creatures left on the level. That seems to happen more than just, like, coincidence, but it probably is just coincidence, right? I don't think there's any special code that's like, hey, if there's no creatures left on the level, shaft the player. Um... <laughs> Oh, hey, little elephants. Well, I guess they're not little if they're dire elephants. Yeah, well, they're big enough to push me around, so yeah, definitely not little. What's that shield? Oh, it's plus two. Huh. Oh, no, not teleportitis. I gotta reset that one. I gotta get out of combat, though, first, before I go drinking potions. I hope I've got... decent number of potions of mutation, but we'll see. How much damage is that with this guy be minus 99? I better sub and slash it. There we go. Yeah, I mean, I should just be charging it against the guy that does 99 damage. All right. Well, now that I'm out of combat, I can finally reset that. Where's my... Oh, six mutations. I guess that's fine. Especially since I'll probably get an early death talisman. So I... Uh, minus two strength. I have beak for a mouth. Oh, what's a beak do? Just a little bit of base damage. Six base damage to go to accuracy. 56% chance of triggering. I have probably made up for the minus strength. I get a little bit of auxiliary attacks. Yeah, that's actually pretty good. Especially since I couldn't um, use a helmet anyway, so I don't lose anything to get the beak. A Wuji and a uh, shape is a strong combo. It's like a free axe of mobility. Yeah, it really kind of is. When you're moving around and just like whoa, we're attacking everyone around you. It's I mean, he's got a few restrictions, but I guess it also does have the extra mobility on top of it, so, I don't know. Definitely good. And anyway, I guess you're not limited to an axe either, you can use claws or something if you're a troll. Alright, level 3 down. I think I've been down to level 4, because I've been down everywhere with that shaft. Oh, it's like a little, uh, little... What are these places? Like a little butchery or something. Uh... Wait, there's a WAP here, but I think I had a Book of Battle or something, or so a WAP might be slightly better. Maxwell has a Vise Electric Charge. What is this one? Fulsum Fuselade, Starburst Sting, Magnavolt Animate Armor, okay. Ignition or Radiate, I don't think those are both spells I need. Yeah, I just eventually I want to get the Manifold Assault going. <laughs> just to add it to my list of things to get, like armor skill, more shape shifting. Uh, how much spellcasting that would, well, uh, translocations that would be. It's got to be at least 20, right? As someone was, uh, Wait, why do I have so much intelligence? Where's that coming from? Oh, my hat. That's a super hat of intelligence. Ignis's Bride is a really good hat. Not that I need the intelligence yet, but... If I want to have a Tobit getting mana for the soul, they certainly do. Uh, can't move anywhere, unfortunately. <laughs> Although, uh, if I get into gold dragon armor, I do have to still get myself some resist electric, don't I? Because that's kind of the nice thing about the statue forms. At least you get poison immunity and resist electric. I shouldn't go down again. I should go straight to the elven holes because I know that my willpower is still excellent. We gotta check on that. Oh, four pumps? Yeah, I mean, that's at the point where it'd be zero percent on basically everything, or maybe one percent on something if you were unlucky.
Let's go Jake, actually. This guy's a near percent of banishment. That's good. That is what I want to see. And most of these elves are... Uh, well, they will either find me a melee or be able to reflect their own bolts back at them. Um, I didn't really need a ring of fire. I was wearing... Actually, what am I resist right now? I'm one of lots of things. I'm wearing specifically the resist rings. Um, hopefully I find some better rings in here or something. We'll see. All right, well, I'll get the strength, I think. Top that one back up. It somehow went down. I can't... Re oh, right, a mutation. That's how it went down. The minus two strength mutation or whatever. But I got a beak, which definitely makes up for it. What how much damage this beak does do? Because it doesn't really list like its actual damage. It just lists its base damage. Um, It doesn't even list like what it scales off. I feel like it would be nice if it had a actual formula there. But like the one when I list my unarmed damage here. Like how it's got a formula. I wish it kind of had that in with uh, um, auxiliary attacks as well. So you can see exactly what they're doing. Because base damage doesn't really tell you a lot. It just kind of gives you an idea of how it scales. What is that ring? Oh, it's not even an artifact. I think I'm going to... Oh, I do have a digging. Um, I don't think it's worthwhile, though. That's not how you feel possible. That's like 80% failure. Oh, they go to... Wait, I might be able to do one there. There we go, so we got, oh, more intelligence, short, and, um, I don't really need more intelligence. I'm just going to get out of here, if I can. What, how many times I should, like, cast that max before I get too contaminated? Like, I was going with three, but I wasn't really sure. I mean, three seemed pretty safe. I was, I was not even getting to the white contamination. I was only getting to the, the light gray contamination. I'd do the Hall of Blades. Just to free up the staircase, basically, all the escape hatches on the level beneath. Oh, no, it's distortion, isn't it? Quick blade of distortion. Um, probably just zap it with one so they next see it. Do quick blade enemies, they do attack more, right? They get, like, a couple of attacks every round or something. I don't know. I just know that, like, enemy attack delays are a bit different, but I still think they get the... Extra attacks. Also, I could get alarmed up here. I might actually just grab a tambourine, the dude. There we go. Now, can I get a... Oh, it might be out of range of the light. It is. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'll try that with some light. Hey, there we go. Excellent. Let's go downstairs. I appear to be done there. Uh, do I magic map to this bazaar as well? Also, this I can use this for whatever I like. Like, get a rig of... Get a manual of evocations. I don't think I need the protection. Yeah, I might get the manual, I guess. I'll probably get a little bit more evocations because I feel like I only got like five or something, which is really not a lot. Also, I guess I, I should revelations this place, see where I need to be. Oh, right there. I'm right next to where I need to be. Uh, yeah, drop the drop that fire protection. Oh, not protection fire, the actual fire one. Got one cold one on, I might drop the other one. That'll do. Let's go in and see what we've got. So, potions. Yes, I'll grab some of those. Any lignification? 
I don't feel like I do because I'm going to get a death alley as we go. Probably not too far to the future. Uh, this ignition. I've seen it outside of here. What else do we have? Nauseous Bug, Vile Clutch. I don't think I'm going to get those. All Annihilations. All the nice level spells. That's never going to happen. Uh, I don't think I need to hail some of the frozen ramparts. I don't need a ride blind. I don't need a death channel. What else have we got? Oh, there's a region. Okay. There's a protection ring again. No, nah, they're not looking that good. None of them are artifacts, unfortunately. That was kind of disappointing. Um, I honestly don't think there's anything here I need, though. How's the curing going? Oh, 25. Let's just get out of here. Yeah, a bit of a shame. Oh, where are we going? Yeah, that's fine. I kind of worried because you got this whole vault here with all the top elves, but thankfully it didn't end up in it. What Boris says, do I look like the kind of man who dies? I mean, he just died, even if not permanently. Uh, I like some of Boris's lines. They're kind of cool. I mean, it is actually kind of true. He really is the kind of the kind type of guy that dies. Um, I might burn these guys up, and I don't think it works that well on the one in front. But I feel like if, if there was one character you could play as in this game, Boris would definitely be OP. <laughs> Just a uh, not having the ability to, like, die permanently. Uh oh I think I gotta teleport out, actually. This guy just summoned it, like, it's, it's a middle one. Then there's a whole bunch of these guys that are buffed up. Man, that was a, not the best start to that. Oh, well. These are just the middle just want to head around the corner most of the time instead of, like, spamming torment or something. I know this ending is like a little bit harder as a melee, um, slow character. <laughs> Although, actually, the reflection is doing a lot there. She's reflecting back crystal spheres. Okay, 20 inch shields is pretty good. Do I just get, I'm just gonna get shaved hitting to 23. Let's do it. Yeah, the death tally's been going, although I'm probably also going to get the armor. Wait, that had a fancy something. Firestar, I love manifolds holding with that, but I don't think I will this time around. Oh, look at that ring. Fire resist, cold resist, resist negative wizardry. That's going straight on one of my fingers. Oh, Arachne. Huh. Wait, she... Where's some of the elves as well? That's kind of funny. Uh, the torment is not so funny, though. If I have to teleport out of this is fine. Oh, it's, uh, I think it's teleport time. Then take me very far. I do another teleport. Um. Oh, I had another one. At least I got tons of them. Hey, there we go. They got me somewhere safe. Man, it was all that one demonologist that was the problem. Anyway, I can now put on a better rig instead of... Let's say cold resist, why not? Yeah, there we go, got a second fire resist. Oh, please rather from deconstructing me. Um... I think I fog and then back up. All right, what's next? And I think that's a good rig. I mean, that was a pretty good rig. I want one with some resist electric. Thanks, guys. I don't think I can guarantee a specific rig or anything, but hey. Well, let's go back. I'm pretty sure I got like at least two resist negative. Yeah. Because I got one off a rig, one off my statue form. 
Oh, I think I summon slash. I actually could have been doing the whole uh, heavily storm go through here. That might have actually done the trick. I don't know. It really depends. Like, if you don't get too damaged doing it, you can just kill everything. Oh, the Balak, some Wizard Ike's regret. Well, I probably would regret it if I did use that one, given my damage would completely disappear. Because my claw damage is good. Oh, fire resist ring with strength on it. It's minus, what, three decks? Uh, sure. Whatever. Uh, I'm still going to put it on. It lets me see invisible as well. So I got, what, well, seven decks? Yeah, a little sad. I don't know, I could get decks on level up, just top it up a little bit, or... But it's not necessarily guaranteed that I'll be sticking with that rig. Like, it might find something better later on. Yeah, what wizardry? Sure. Uh, I'm more worried about the wizardry, but I also don't feel like I need to worry about this rig either. Wait, what was the... Right, it was fire the strength. Wait, that's actually not too bad yet, because it gives the extra damage with the strength and everything. What have we got? I don't need the poison release right now. It's got willpower, minus decks, minus five decks, and four slaying. No, I don't really need those resists. Uh, maybe later on if I lose my statue form. I'll, no, if I lose my statue form, I'm going either lich form or... Yeah, actually, so I don't need poison resist from anything, do I? Oh, I should finish the swamp. And they go to the depths. I might as well just read the scroll to the floor and the bit of combat because it's just a little dragon. So there was a Lunane Hydra around here somewhere, which was the main warrior on this level, and I don't have the best ranged attacks. But I'm thinking I could probably just fight it now. Unless I'm horribly mistaken, but I think I can, because uh, it's a it's not the ancient one, it's like the skeletal one, which does less damage each attack. I'm constricted. Sure. Made my summon slash a little bit less useful when I was just getting straight it up and stuff. Oh uh, well. Uh, that's the other side, right? The other side that has the rune, the side with the plants on it, sure. But I do have the resist corrosion, so I think this is kind of fine. And at this point, the Oklahoma plants don't do that much damage. There we go. There's my second rune. Let's go to the depths, clear that out, then go get a third rune. That was a ziggurat. Um, I don't think I'm the right sort of character for a ziggurat. But actually, these things like manifold souls are too bad at once. So if I do get the manifold salt going, I could probably go do the ziggurat or something. Oh, another Woodian. That's my third Woodian also. Bitch, I think with this character, I'm going to go get a Woodian title at the end because I've gone through so many of the other troll titles, like the throwing ones, the shield ones, the I don't know. Yes, yeah, Woodian ones left. Oh, strength, cold resist, but minus edge. Uh, nah, not that special. And we've got ice intelligence, also not that special. This is like my third death value in this game. Sitting in there. There's also poison resist AC minus three intelligence. Again, not that special. Any manuals? No manuals. There's a book of the dragon. Oh, dragon's cool. But I think at some stage I was going to summon a try troll summoner, but I was going to try that maybe after the streak. Like actually try to stick in summoning and everything as a troll. It was on my list of things to try at some stage. Uh, how do I get to that brain? I don't know, I guess I just walk up to it. After killing the things it summoned. Oh, it would be cool if the game gave you uh, combo titles. Like if you have... 27 out of 27 air, you get the last tear vendor or something. 
Yeah, that would that would add a lot of titles, right? Man, it would actually be kind of cool though. I feel like like there's gotta be there needs to be one for gnolls that makes out all their skills, so you can be like a gnoll at all or something. There really does need to be some combo titles. In fact, I think there's nothing that pre prevents combo titles, maybe apart from like the ordering. How the game? Because uh, it's based on like if you get two skills to the same level, it's based on which one you got to that level first. I'm not sure quite how that would work with combo titles. It might still work. Hey, Sojo Bo. Uh. That's fine, I'm only a little corroded. I'll do my sub and slash. Yeah, there we go. Everything is going fine. Two corrosion doesn't really matter. It's probably minus two armor class. It is theoretically also minus two damage, but I uh, hate when I'm doing 60 damage. Oh, 83 damage? Okay. It really doesn't matter. <laughs> what if my damage get up to 83? I know I got some more strength. I mean, that would have helped. Ooh, a gold dragon? Shrike? Um, I want to kill the gold dragon. What about these other guys, though? I know, I'm just insane. It certainly is. I mean, I have to stop trading it for a little while, but it's still... Still pretty insane. I'm gonna pop this open. Grab a tambourine, these guys. Yeah, I did get a little corroded, but not too bad. They'll do it just fine. Holy oh, god, dragon just died. Did it have armor though is the real question. Hey, it did. Well, fancy that. Okay. Maybe I shouldn't be enchanting up my shield if I go to enchant a gold dragon arm, but hey, that doesn't matter. Let's drop the evasion. Uh, I think my competition is doing just fine. I'll pick it up, but I don't have the armor skill just yet. So I need to get the um, shape-shifting skill to 23. Then I get like uh, 20 armor skill or something. And I can swap armor. And go to a death mob. Oh, you learned that a strength ring is better than slaying for unarmed? Yeah, definitely. At least um, after the early game, of course. No, I mean, I do did get that extra five strength, but still, it's kind of crazy damage. All right, where's the way down? Um... And it's technically more than it shows as well, because that doesn't show the bonus, um... I don't, don't want to get the brilliance yet. We'll get the mutation, just in case. It doesn't show, like, the bonus from statue form. Um, it does show the slowness from statue form, though, which is interesting. Ooh, an acquirement, okay. And you can tell because it gives, like, the formula it uses to work out the damage. Um, so you can tell it's not doing the extra melee damage. Right, what's that amulet? Rampage is nice. Acrobat, okay, it's alright. Acrobat doesn't really work with Wujian very well, though, because it gets turned off every time you attack. Are you going standard? I think I will, K-Man. Yeah, I definitely think I will. Do I want a Conjurations manual? Do I want any of this stuff? I don't really need Conjurations. I don't need a Storm Talisman. I'm not going to go with that. Even though I could. Um, I currently got a... Just a... Acrobat. Not an Acrobat Amulet. I don't know. I mean, that Amulet's fine. I don't think I'll go with it, though. Uh, whatever. It doesn't look that tempting. I might eventually end up going back to that, like, uh, magic regen album I saw, like, super early game. Where's Norris? There he is. Yeah, I mean, I instantly knew it was Norris when there was the sharks around, because they don't really spawn naturally in here, so it had to be him. Or I guess it might be on the vaults that it could be as well. <laughs> Brains are... Braids are buffing each other up. Um, I've tried lightning rather, but 
Oh, actually, not too bad. I don't think my lightning rod does the most da damage, actually. I was going to get some more demon cages, but I can wait. I want to get the shape shifting. They get the armor skill. Oh, is that what I think it is? The dark ball? It is, too. It does a hundred and something damage. Wait, this guy can do like a hundred and eighty eight damage in one turn. If it makes that damage, let's just summon slash slash. Man, Dark Ball's tempting, but... I don't think I can do it right now. Like, uh, I'm so into the unarmed that it would not really quite work. I still want to look at it, though. So if I attack with it, uh, it oh, it's like 5 attack delay. <laughs> 140, 150 damage. Yeah, I mean, 5 attack delay is never going to work. But maybe, like, sometime in extended, I might be able to get that one going. But it's going to be, like, uh... Oh, it's two-handed, so I lose my shield, but... Oh, well. If I do get that one going, it would be after I've got the Death Bomb going, after I've got the Armor going, and after I've got the Manifold Assault going, so... It will be quite late. But I'd love to take that one to the Iron City that does some Manifold Assault with it. Because it's just so ridiculous when you do that. I was like some chokers or something to eat. I want some food. A rambutan. Right, I'll take one of those. So I just left some javelins. Um, not that I've got... Uh, not that i got like massively to throw a gun or anything, but I should probably grab it. Is it a torment, I guess? Oh, Torbeck could always be useful if I'm going the whole uh, death bomb route. Oh, well. Also, what do I want to chant? Maybe my gold dragon armor, but I'm not wearing it yet, so it doesn't make sense to enchant it just yet. Uh, somebody throwing weapons for a character that barely doesn't even use the throwing. What was that requirement again? That's the one that I still... Oh, I don't think I'll grab the Ambler. I might just get my money back on that one. Also, <laughs> lots of money. I wonder if these are actually big piles. Oh, 20-something, 10, 20, 15, 19, 40... Yeah, I mean, there's actually decent size of 5, 20, 20 something. Yeah, that's sure. It adds up, I guess. Oh, hey, Boris. <laughs> I wonder what he's going to say this time, though, when I finish him off. Let's see. You haven't seen the last of me? Yeah, probably not. I'll probably be back in crypt or something. Or even the orb run. Uh, this is fine. Need to sub and slash these guys. There we go. Oh, the orb spider is a little annoying. Oh, I think it's fine. <laughs> yeah, it's just not really possible to avoid the orb. Um. Oh. Uh, I'm on 150 health. That's still fine. It won't kill me with like a single ball or something because I don't need a healing potion up just yet. What just shot me? A ball to spell energy. There it is. Draconian. It should be the, there we go, the entrance. Wait, no, I can't see it yet. There it is, the entrance to Zot. It's got to be one of the areas with some of the most recognizable, um, like, vaults leading to it. I mean, there might be, is there anything else with, like, a more recognizable vault leading to it? I'm not sure if there is. 
Well, so the royal jelly it used to have like a really recognizable vault because it was always the same, but now there's like number of different vaults that can lead to the royal jelly. I don't know. It feels like the. I guess that's not exactly leading to a branch, it's leading to a creature, but it's a similar sort of idea. See, some of the hell vaults can be pretty recognizable as well. Anyway, where do I go? I need another rune. I'll do false five because that should be easy. Hopefully. Uh, Alright. No escape hatch. That's fine. I'll just read a teleport. Unfortunately, it might teleport me before I get down here. Done. Good. Because of the Sagi form. Oh, these guys are... Chaos? Chaos. Sure. That's kind of recall, isn't it? Maybe. Do you have no idea what it's doing? Um, not recalling though, apparently. Hey, go shape shooting's worth the SP. Let's get the armor. So I'll get the armor up to. Uh, oh, I probably should get it all the way to twenty. My fighting's actually not that good this time round, but oh uh, well, I guess. Uh, I get it all the way to twenty. Uh, I'm gonna get it to a point where this gold dragon armor is worth wearing. Because currently, if I put it on, that's misleading. It doesn't give me that much armor class. It's like 12 armor class compared with uh, this one's 35. Right, it's quite a lot less, I guess. So would that allow me to put, me on, uh, put on anything else? I can't wear gloves anyway. I don't think it does, right? As a troll? I'm pretty sure I'm pretty much limited to the stuff that the statue form limits apart from body armor. <laughs> so, yeah, because statue form is like kind of made for trolls with the limits it gives. I'll stop with that shield. It's uh, plus zero tower shield, sure. Oh, that looks like my rune, once I can get to it. Oh, I don't like that old spider there. Hold up. I might just serve and slash get rid of that one. There we go. But otherwise, he's going to sit there trying to zap me with orbs. Well, not exactly zap, but hit me with orbs while I'm busy. The flail of Lord's is still entering. Still not what I need. If I was going to go with any sort of mace of flails type thing, it would be the Dark Maul for maximum damage with Manifold Assault, which I think, uh, hold up. Does it make sense to get the armor next? Or does it make sense to get the Manifold Assault next? Um, the armor's going to make the Manifold Assault harder to get, which is why I'm warning about that. Oh, manual armor. It probably makes sense to get the armor next. That's not it. Where's my armor? It's this one. So it's now 16 armor classes. It's trying to compete with 35 or something, so I lose like... I don't know, 10 armor classes or something at the moment. Instead of more, maybe 9, because I can charge it up, but I can't charge up much. I'm kind of hoping for, uh, what's his name? The troll dude, Pajit. But it's unlikely. He does sometimes hang out in uh, Zot, though, so maybe. Oh, good. Another shot up. That's, um, that's progress. I can think I can basically just want to explore at this point. There's not too much of this level left. Uh, yeah. I'll It'll take me through the sense. Oh. Oh, I mean that's fine, but like, oh wait, 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 one of those is reflected. No, one of those is not gonna hit me. That's fine. And the other one got reflected as well. Right, I thought those were both going for me for a second there. Ring of the Tottenham. What am I wearing? I'm wearing like. Fire is a strength or fire is cold resist resisting of wizardry. Huh. 
No. Let's... Okay, so 41 armor class. If I... Put on this one. Put on the tortoise. Does this have a strength one? I'm not sure. 33. Oh my, oh, my damage goes down a lot without the strength on. And strength is doing a lot for me. Uh, what about instead of the wizardry one? I kind of want that one on, though. Nah, that doesn't seem worthwhile. Uh... Hmm. I might just not put on the tortoise right now. Can't quite slot it into what I've got going there. I can almost get it, it's just mm, not quite. How's that army going? I mean, it's making decent progress. Hmm. Just got the stash. I mean, it's already next to me. I might as well just get casted to do best. Oh, right next to the rune as well. I mean, I should go for that. I'm on the wrong side, aren't I? And that's not thinkable. <laughs> it's like so far away in actuality. That's not sustainable. It's not. There's the Quark X guarding it as well. Um, oh, I feel frail. Unfortunately, don't have my death though. He's been on minus score. I'm probably going to have to reset these after being in here. Uh, what a heavenly storm. There we go, Connor. Got my, well, is that my third rune or my fourth rune? Hold on, that's my fourth rune right there. I also can't get over the lava, uh, get lava very easily, so I might just retreat back. I'm also very noisy, which is a little unfortunate, but oh well. Uh, guys are not standing in areas where I can get the um the whirlwind attacks. Cause I got a whirlwind attacks to keep my heavenly storm charged up. Oh, how's it going? It's going pretty well, Oswald. Yep, yeah, got a got bounced to the abyss, but hey, got the rune, so not too bad, right? How are you going there, Oswald? I'll toss out my manual of armor, sure. Uh. Does my AC would remain unchanged? Oh, if I take it off, that's even less helpful having it on. Um. Oh, come on. This I guess I got a gateway lead. Yeah, I wasn't managing my attacks. Wait, what? What? Gateway leading out of the abyss. Oh, the vault's warning. Oh, okay. Sure. So I'm on vault 5. I was a little confused and saying, well, it's warning me leaving the abyss, but no, that actually checks out. <laughs> oh, what's that up? Damage is not quite 120. Actually, it might be. It's like, like 85, but it's actually... It's actually 50% higher than that, so I think you might actually be quite right with your um, estimate there. You know, the point nine attack delay. So, yeah, good damage. Oh, wait, it's going to have to reset my mutations once I, because it got badly mutated or something. No, those look good. Yeah, frail too. Shame, because I'm going to lose my beak, I think, but that will. Oh, no, I've still got a beak. So now I've got some intelligence to go with it, because why not, I guess. Um, I won't continue with the armor just yet. I'm actually, 
kind of tempted to get the translocations, get the manifold salt going with minus three aptitude, and then go get some other stuff going. Um, might just go to Zot. There's also the slime pits, but I think that I can wait until I got my death tallies been going. 15 rune to right here. Yep, that's the plan. I remember Manifold Assault gets cut in half when unarmed it does, which is a little bit of a shame, but hey. I still want to get it going. Also, I've got a Dark Maul, which I might go to later. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see if I ever get that one going or not, because I got so much skill requirements. And I've got a wizardry on, which makes things a little bit easier to get. But once I get my gold dragon armor on, I'm not sure if I can actually make this work. So I'm not sure if I should have got that armor skill or not. Uh, maybe not. Maybe I should just stick with it. Oh, I kind of want to do the... I don't want to stick with the statue form, though. What has happened to me? I don't think anything happened to me. Like, what did happen to me? I guess I resisted. I must have. Alright, what's next? Oh, now they go to Dragon. Sure. Well, so many gold dragon armors. Every single gold dragon I've come across dropped his armor this time round. I feel like it's got to be the best gold dragon luck I've had in ages. Maybe ever with that amount of gold dragon armor. What don't you like about statue form? Um, I don't know. I mean, it's got slightly slower movement, but yeah, I mean, it kind of just works. Oh, I should... And the main thing I don't like is that I can't have the death form on, so I can't be immune to torment. But... I don't know if there's much in the other, in the other downsides. Um... Wait, that's not my light? Where's my light? W, capital. Half damage from torment. Yeah, so I guess it's halfway there. Already, so it's maybe don't need to switch it up, and I guess it makes my casting easier. Also, do I have the manifold salt on me, or do I have to go buy the book of the battle? I think I have to go buy that book of the bat book of battle. Yeah, let's do it. All the way at dungeon level three. I think I got my statue form like around there as well. Let's see. Yeah, statue form was on dungeon level three, so it's really setting me up for later on with this level. Uh, why has it got auto completion there? That's weird. Sure, I've never seen that before. Anyway, let's get the manifold sold, the apportation, the blank, passage of Galabria. Yeah, I'll do. Uh oh, I'll drop two floors. Um, that one. Uh, that one is dealing with as well as that one. I might just do a. I might do a heavenly storm and then a serpent slash specifically in that order because the serpent slash gives um exhaustion and you can't start the heavenly storm while you've got the exhaustion on. It's a bit noisy, but it does kill everyone, so I guess that's not too bad. Oh, there we go. There's a staircase up. Let's go take... Oh, okay. That's actually not too bad. There's a ghost moss. It's... Oh, so that's all three of my staircases. So maybe it is too bad. I just saw, like, a moth coming along. I might actually finish this level before I... Go head back into the... <laughs> um... What is that? It's Ty Sisha's ghost, a pharmacist hunter of Dismenos. That sprite looks funny, but I think it's correct. Huh. They got like a little whirlwind of their offhand or something, which is um adding to the look. 
Wait, did that stack say unexplored? It did. Which means they can't lead into the same group as all the other creatures. Yeah, so, oh wait, both of said unexplored? I thought all the staircases led to, like, the same spot. Oh, those are up staircases. Oh, I'm just being silly. Okay. So any of the up staircases here will work, basically, apart from the initial one I took. Sure. I well, I guess that was getting kind of corralled as well. Now was the third one? Wait. It's basically the same spot, but oh well. Uh, try this one again. Okay. Maybe not. Uh, there's still the escape hatch, but I reckon this one's got another couple of tries in it. Alright, level 25. Let's go and peek the staircase again. It's got tactical monstrosities all over it. Oh, it's a bit of a risk, but I think I actually take the escape hatch. Hey, that doesn't look too bad. We'll see what comes along, though, now that I'm up here with no way back down. Blink was remarkably harmless because it kind of just put me back into the midst of the guys where I could just keep on doing my thing. Uh, I saw most of the upstairs, right? They were in the middle of all those creatures. So I just got to kind of draw creatures off that spot until I'm ready. Oh, Another roll of fire, all right. Uh, what just happened to me? Willpower's fine. Minus potions is not the best. Oh. Do I just leave, live with it now, or do I reset it? I think I live with it for a little bit, but once... Oh, I'm actually not going to get the death form on, am I? It's not in a hurry. I might eventually get it, but... It was hard for the armor to compete, unfortunately. In terms of actually protecting me. Uh, cursed, oh, I might just hang around this corner. Let it come round towards me. Does it take magic to do my abilities? It does not. So, I don't think until I get the manifold soul going, I don't think I've got any use for magic points. Which, speaking of uh, manifold soul, it's like 70% there. Well, not there. 70% failure. So, I guess 30% there or something. Yeah, that's fine. Probably fine in this guy's berserk, I think. Yeah, it's dying with my damage. Uh, still 83. I don't think that's changed because I haven't got any unarmed in a while. Could go up again, right? Because I uh, might just complete this level, though. It's like so close to being done. Alright, there we go. Now I can fully explore the level above, which I don't think there's much of this one left either. Oh, another rob of fire. Ah, oh, the game really wants me to fight those, doesn't it? Uh Hidden genetic defects, okay. Sure. I should probably reset, see what happens to me. Nine mutations, let's see. I've got 
Low magical capacity, beak for a mouth of intelligence. That's probably fine. Yeah, I'll stop there, definitely. Man, I might go quiver on my manifold assault so I can watch that chard strickle down. Oh, what? I've done that level. Uh, where am I going to go next? That's a real question. Okay. Oh, well, it's still slowed. Although, I think I got hit by Quicksilver, so... I guess in the end, it doesn't matter. I should magic map out this level. Oh, Slime done? Not yet. Maybe I don't need to worry about the mutations too much. Maybe we can just go do Slime. I could statue form up, but... Oh, statue form, death form up, maybe. But then I wouldn't be able to manifold Soul. That's probably fine. Yeah, I can maybe probably just death form up. We've got man Heard's ghost, a minotaur fighter. Actually, not max the damage. 60 AC? I guess they're a minotaur fighter. Um, I'll just leave them be. Their damage is way lower than mine, so I'd probably have a decent chance of being able to kill them, but I don't know. 60 AC is kind of a lot. More than me, I'm sitting on 40. Actually, I think I can't kill him. Yeah, because their damage wasn't too bad. Excellent. Now I need to go to... I've got the Corrupt to do as well, don't I? Um, I might do the Corrupt and then maybe the Slime Birds. Fortunately, no Pardon for me today. A little bit of a shame, but oh well. Does Pudget? Pudget sometimes hangs around the crypt, I think. I think it's a possibility. And I know some of the other ones like VB also hang around here. Khufu is probably the worst one that hangs around here. Oh, who else has down the crypt? Oh, Frederick, apparently. I just blasted himself back. That's kind of funny. I mean, it didn't actually help him because I was just able to lunge attack him from Wuji in any way. In fact, it probably actually hindered him because the lunge attack does 20% extra damage. Yeah, so I don't think a two can paralyze. Um, so I should be fine. Oh, and I guess Menos can hang out in here as well. So there actually are a number of uniques that can hang out in the crypt if you... I don't know if that's lucky or unlucky. I mean, some of them might be lucky for me. Oh, why did my deck so Oh, got reduced by... Sure. By my mutation. But so it's an end mutation, so I probably want it anyway. At least if I have any hope of getting this manifold assault going, which I think I do. It's looking pretty good. Uh, and so far the growth has been kind of easy. I've just been picking off and I don't think I can be crossed in here. Oh hey, Menos. It is Menos. Um I'll pull him around a corner, I think. What's this shield? Is it nothing? It's oh, I'll supposed to. Then that allows me to serpent slash him. Oh, what? Okay, my beak missed him. Did he just block or something? Why did I just, did he did I just roll zero damage? I guess I just rolled zero damage or something. Cause it's uh um, meant to ignore its evasion, so I guess. I mirror him up. Menace versus Menace fight, which unfortunately he didn't stick around that long. I might get him with a Gravitambourine, get him constricted. Didn't last that long either. I think I'm killing him though. There we go.
All right, let's uh, go down to the last level of the crypt. Well, this should have all the tough stuff on it and maybe some treasure. I'm hoping for a ring of resist electric, but I uh, can't guarantee that. Uh, oh, look at that. Fancy gold dragon armor. I mean, if I'm going with gold dragon armor, that might do the trick. We'll see what it's enchantment does. It might be it might be trash, but hey, it's worth looking at at least. Oh, seems like uh pandemonium time to you, you reckon? Yeah, probably. Probably is. Uh actually, I'll just love the old explore take me stuff. Uh get the rest of this level done. Oh hey Boris! You want the orb? You'll never get it? We'll see about that, Boris. You certainly won't be the one to stop me. Oh, he says this isn't the end, it's only just beginning. <laughs> I'll try and say like third time I met him is like only just the beginning. <laughs> well, we'll see how many times I meet him. Okay. Uh, gotta step on one of these to release these dudes. I could also... I just dig half of them out. And then I could go release the other dudes by... Uh, actually, I should go around this way. There we go, and it's, uh, oh, plus zero gold dragon armor, but it's got willpower, regen, resist, corrosion, three dags. Man, if only I was, like, a mountain dwarf, that would actually be good, I think. Storm bomb, not notch, uh, yeah, I mean, that's, that's full on, that's, like, peak mountain dwarf armor right there, starting at plus zero, but how protective is that? It's not that protective, right? I mean, I can't really tell. Um, because I've already got gold dragon armor on, apparently. But it wouldn't be that protective. I mean, I can end the form, take a look. 20-something. Nah. That's a shame. Alright, where can, where can I go now? Oh, the manifold sold 60%. Is it just pandemonium time? It might just be pandemonium time. I think it is. Alright, let's head on in. Oh, the demonic rune on this area, is there? Huh. Oh, the stuff of gin and tonic? <laughs> Man, it almost seems like it should be old grown stuff that confuses everyone. <laughs> that needs the stuff of gin and tonic. Oh, this is one of the little guys. Okay, I might try manifold salt. Whoa, I have no magic points. Um... <laughs> Yeah, okay, spell casting, please. <laughs> now I hadn't thought of that as a problem before I uh, try getting my manifold salt, but I guess it is. Oh, no, there's a torment. I might try teleport out. Um, I'd get me massively far. The problem is the top end is back. Uh, can move back here. Oh, still in view. I'm just going to drink a healing potion, I think. And then I'm going to try another teleport. Maybe this will take me a bit further. <laughs> Ooh, another top end. Okay. There we go. Finally got a good teleport. It took a few tries, though, unfortunately. I do want to stay on this level because it's the one that's got my rune. Man, how many manifold souls is that? Is that three manifold souls and a amount of magic points? I think it is. Because it's seven magic points each one. And yeah, it is. At least I got no other use for my magic points, so I actually can kind of use them that way. Um...
What have we got here? Bolt of Devastation. Okay, that's probably fine. Uh... Tom Ender, on the other hand, is not so good. Oh, there's another dude that can torment. Um, I might fog up. Oh, it didn't help. And then teleport. Bath. Fog is annoying. Okay, I'll drink a healing potion and then hopefully the teleport will go off. Yeah, it's a constant torment problem. So that's uh, kind of the reason I was trying to get into heavy armor, but... Make my life so much harder in heavy armor. And I think there's going to be a number of tormentors come out of here because there's a bunch of live inside here. Like you can see that one behind the wall and stuff. How am I resist setting? A little bit lower the cold resist. That's setting on one. Fire resist setting on two, which is probably perfectly fine. Ah, gave myself a minus move. I mean, it was bound to happen eventually. All right, some more of these smoke demons taken care of. I haven't seen a lot of the torments behind the bars. I think it was just one so far. No, oh, no, there's a guy that can torment. Ah, minus move again. What am I on? The eight percent failing. Yeah, the minus move is definitely going to crop up a bit. All right, which side has got the rune behind it? I mean, I guess I can just try both. Oh, first try. I get a demonic rune. Was there something else? A mutation potion. Excellent. I will need one of those, possibly. And the side just junk, so I can go to the next level. Uh, no runes, all right. Oh, what's that? Hell Sentinel. My mirror at. Wanted to die quickly because I'm not on full health right now. All right. Got to look at the dark move, but I reckon it's pretty ridiculous. Five point four percent attack delay. Yeah, not percent. Uh, turn attack delay. How good is a base of flails app dude? It's minus one. It's not too bad. Oh, I feel stupid. Raise me back up to 9% fail on the manifold assault. That's unfortunate. Uh, how many times did I just miscast that? Anyway, I might just close the door and let this guy move up to me because I, well, I could move for a little while there. Uh, 26 magic points. That's so, uh, I need to get a 28 before I can cast the fourth time, I think. Uh, hey, we'll get there eventually. I don't level. I was going to get more decks because my decks was looking kind of sad. I didn't want to get it straight to zero or something. All right, next level. What have we got? Oh, Dark Rune. There's a guy uh, that the torments. And the spell of Dead's. Um, 
Oh, I left my Brilliance Potion down up here, didn't I? I don't think I've got those on me. It's, uh, I don't think they have got them below to pick up, which I probably should. Where's the... Uh, wait, Potions. Brilliance. Oh, well, next time I see a way out of hell, I should go... Oh, uh, pad on you. I just go fix that one up. Uh, so I guess I went into here not really being able to cast because I didn't really, yeah, I didn't really have the whole oh, menace full sword going when I went in. Um... You know that Galorix block is not too far behind here. I'll be right around one of these corners. I'm not sure which one exactly. How many haste potions do I have? Ten good. That's what I'd like to see. I do one now. I hope it's not too early. There he is. I want to serpent slash him. There we go. Took care of him nice and quick. I got his rune. Excellent. <laughs> oh, I think I just ruined his mark view, which means he's going to get blinded, weakened. What else does it do? I don't know. It does a bunch of things. Maybe it's just blinded and weakened. I'm not sure. It's enough to make it a little bit harder to hit at least. Um... Why are you getting blinded so much? It's all the, the new demon spawn. What are they called? They got reworked. One of the demon spawns, uh, might be a corrupt or something, has Mark of Ruin. And then once you get hit in melee with Mark of Ruin on, you get blinded. So that's a relatively new change. It didn't used to be a thing. <laughs> Let's take the next level. Ooh, Fiery Ruin. Emily Storm, Serpent Slash, okay. This is going all right, but I'm taking a bit of damage. Right, okay. I know kind of where the boss is. Um, I can, do I have a potion resistance? Because six of them. I wouldn't buy one of those with the boss, although I'm not sure exactly which side the boss is just yet. Probably not. This side is not really open enough. I might just go explore it. Um. Yeah, it's a little tragic room, so resist cold, resist corrosion. What have we got on? I've still got the strength fire this one, which makes a lot of sense in here. So got that wizardry one, right? Oh, it's reflection region minus fire resist. Um This isn't the right level for some minus fire resist, but I do want to pick that one up. What am I carrying around? I still got that shot armor. No, do I use that on my shield or my body armor? <laughs> uh, maybe I should have left the gold dragon armor out of here. I don't know. Anyway, what can I even drop? Um, I could have left the faith out of here as well. Oh, I might drop that one ice blast. I'm not, not going to get a... Oh, wait. I don't need that one to resist corrosion one. I got that on my hat. Do I put it, I mean, I don't put it on right now, but a regen... Oh. Yeah, it's not bad. It's just... Hard to get it working. Okay, Seraphim's in here. Try bringing some of these guys back a little bit, because I don't want to end up surrounded. I think I got a haste up for him as well, and then I might just phantom mirror him. A heavenly storm and serpent slash. What's up, my guys? Thankfully, 
Half of those summons, these aren't. Oh. Not quite what I want to see. I think it's fine. Um. There we go, got him. I don't need a sword, that just burns people if I'm correct. Oh, I always feel like I don't need a sword. I guess there's a two-hander, I don't use a lot of two-handers. There we go, God is rune, let's just go order exploring, see what else we've got here. A staff of Zukok rude. So no, that's basically a staff of ice with a little bit of strength on it. I'm gonna cloak with stealth on right now, except minus plus two. Uh, I care about a ring of ice. I think that's the whole little treasure vault in here explored, so I can just go. I guess next level, yeah. Um. I don't know about a minus fire this tablet, because that would bring me down to one fire this, which in some places is perfectly fine. That I mean, I've dealt with a fiery level of pandemonium, so maybe it is perfectly fine. Rampage is not bad. Actually, I'll put it on. A resist negative is not bad. Brings me up to my third resist negative. Helped a little bit with the torment. That's a uh, what? Metal splinter of the sky? Sure. What is that with a shield? It's oh, plus two talent to go resist. Oh, but that's like plus five. Um. Kind of want to pick it up though, just for Cositus, but I don't have any inventory space. Unless I drop, oh, I guess I drop a basic ring of flight. <laughs> Hopefully, I won't regret that. I've got some potions to give me flight. All right, there should be a portal on here, right? Yeah, there. It is. There you go. Glowing rune. Ugh. Um, where's the death talisman? I have um, not much armor class right now. I guess I would shard my armor. Um, should get back to the transformations, but I might try and get the armor up. Uh, not so I should magic map. Maybe. Actually, maybe not. Got the death button mod. Oh, right, my resists are better, apart from my resist electric in this, so I might be able to swap around some rings or something, try and get my AC back or something. I don't really want to lose the damage, though, so I don't want to lose the strength one, but I could. Uh, that one loses me... Is this fire resist called Wizardry? Losing Wizardry is a bit of a shame, but my Manifold Soul is not really there anyway, so I might just put that one on in this form. So I don't lose too much AC, I just kind of lose the ability of Manifold Assault people, which is a bit of a shame. Yeah, it's just uh, about the same, I think. And I get to do some extra slowing and weakening and stuff, I guess. Oh, marked. Right, can I burn something here? That spread a little bit, okay. If I dig a little bit further up this way, I can keep them... Oh, 
It's the edge of the map, sure. I don't know, I think I just gotta teleport out. The mic's gone, right? Dead, not kill my no leg before I teleport it out, but I tried. <laughs> Uh, my decks and stuff are staying at a reasonable level. I'm going to keep an eye on those, though. Make sure they don't get drained towards zero or something. Hey, at least I don't have to worry so much about the torments anymore now that I've actually got an immunity to the torments. Uh, you know, we weak and fragile, yeah. I don't want to go too much further into here. Weak and fragile. Oh, it's wore off already. Six decks? Come on, guys. Five decks! They try to bomb mutate me, but it's destroying my decks. Yeah, strength drain, at least. Oh, thank goodness. I can't take any more deck strain right now. Uh, I'm gonna try and heavily storm. And of course, I get constricted while heavily storming. So that does confirm that you can, in fact, get constricted while heavily storming. I guess it's good to know. Um, I'm going to run on this heavily storm, aren't I? Maybe not. And I can do a serpent slash in here. Okay, that's a little bit more. I've slowed my no leg. Hey, wait, no, is Manolik still dead? They just always blink back. There we go, finally dead. Why are they hiding their rune, though, is the real question. I mean, I interacted with them, like, so far from where they initially were, I think it's hard to kind of tell where that one was. Uh, not this way, though. This is clearly not it. There we go. There's the rune. Yeah, so it's also an extra mutation potion. If I want to reset, what have I got? I've got a beak for a mouth, and I've got um, low magic points. I mean, those are fine for now. Some say that I might want to try and get some resist or something for a mutation reset. I'm not sure. That's a little bit risky. What is my damage right now? Still 82, except uh, actually less than before, but better attack delay. It's kind of similar. All right, how many more pandemonium levels I got? I got the magical one, which is one where I need cold resist. Oh, also do I have vies? Um, a pile drive. I mean, it's okay. Getting me out of the middle of a group creatures. Yeah, I do have vies. Uh, thirty percent failure though. Can I try and get rid of that failure on my vice? Because, um, Manole, not Manole, like, what's their name? Lob loves to, like, blink away from you, and you've got to try and stay close, at least if you're a melee character. I can just take that staircase down. So we'll see if I can get my vice going in time. It doesn't have to be 100% reliable, 22% is not too bad. I don't need a blade talisman. I'm, uh, yeah, I've got a big shield. I'm not going to give it up for a blade talisman. Definitely not. Uh, I should care about positive energy. It's a real one, right? Oh. Uh. There we go. God, next to that. Oh, no, it moved away. Wait, my, oh, my claws are draining, of course, because I'm in uh, death form. That makes sense. 
Although I feel like cards and stuff in here is not affected by that. It's mainly just affected by the, like the slow and stuff weakness. Can't manifold solo. Just gotta go off and fight the guy. If it banishes me, it banishes me, and I just get out of the abyss. Hey, got my first brilliance potion. Sure. I guess I got time to kind of build that back up, though. Marked again. Uh, I don't think I'll take the way to the abyss. That's one way of, like, unmarking myself, just waiting off in the abyss, but... I don't think it's a sensible thing to do. Alright, what's the Pandemonium Lord do? It does Bolt of Fire, some of the greater demons. I don't have a lot of fire in this, but at least I can get it slowed. Uh, ooh, twelve percent on the fire. So that's looking a little bit better. What we've got here: staff of fire. Might as well just take the way through. Hey, magical rune, excellent. And oh, there's even a way out, which is perfect because I believe this is my last rune, pandemonium rune, not last rune in total. Um. I guess I collab part of the floor set me up for teleports. What do I want to put on when I fight the boss? Um, I definitely want to have haste on because I love to spam things. How could no resist electric? Uh, resistance would be nice because I need the resist electric in here as well. Yeah, no resist electric. Uh, gotta try the vise. Right, so it's haste resistance. That's probably it. Maybe a no. Uh, Probably don't need a brilliance because we'll, uh, we'll be visoring though. <laughs> That's unfortunate <laughs> with that alarm trap. I'm probably just gonna have to teleport at some stage. Maybe. I think the mic would probably attract Lob Lobon, but maybe. Oh no, there they are. Oh, uh, I need to teleport out. I don't have any resist electric. <laughs> All right. Oh, there they are again. Oh, it's still not ready for them. Oh, they're doing the lighting again as well. All right. Well, I've got to definitely got to have the resistance on with how much lighting they're spamming. Let's get back in here. So now they probably would have returned to their boss chambers and I will know more, I have a better idea where they are. Is that me close enough? That's probably me close enough. Right, so I need to put on... I might throw in a mite. Haste. There was something else, I'm sure of it. Resistance, there we go. I don't know if I can do much against that guy apart from reflection. <laughs> oh, it's blinking. Um, I might have put those on too early. Oh, it's further than I thought. Okay, there we go. Good. Slowed. Ow. Taking a bit of damage from the polar vortex. Ooh, only 130 health. I lost my haste as well. 
this is not going anywhere near as well as I'd like. Um, because I put on the haste too early. Uh oh, okay. Oh, that was disappointing. But I guess I can go back to here and try it again, except this time round I know where to put my buffs on. It's just Yeah, it's definitely sad losing those buffs. Alright, let's do it again. Uh, I'd have to use the resistance, otherwise they're going to die. What to the haste again. I think that one's a necessary one. Whoops. Okay, Polybotics is dying. Uh, and I think I'm good because I got the haste on. Yeah, this is doing... Way better than before. Excellent. There we go. That's more like it. I got my ninth room, which means I need to take that exit out of here that I know about. Yeah, I should just take it. Um, uh, I don't want to trade up in terms of skills. I mean, I could get more armor if I'm going with the armor, or I could... Oh, right, I need to enable a skill. I could try for the mate. No, I've got to get more armor. And if I want to do mason flails, I've got to get my spells uh, back, my metaphor assault stuff back, castable. So there's a slime pits to go. There's also something else on this level that looks unexplored. Oh, brilliance, of course. I've got to get that. What sort of cloud was that? Oh, never mind. Whatever it is, it can't be that important. Let's go, let's go pick out the brilliance. It's everywhere. Sure. I need that lignification. Anyway, what's next? There's, oh, more brilliance. Start to level 15. Uh... Well, this is a good game for Brilliance. I'd love to get that uh, great mall going, whatever it's called, Dyke Mall. Because I got 11 Brilliance sitting here. Oh, wait, there's three more. All right, 14 Brilliance. Let's go to, let's go, wait, no, let's go, oh, go to the entrance to help, but that's not where I'm trying to go. Uh, actually, this is, uh, this is one for digging, which I don't have a lot of, but it's worth spending one digging to make this easy. A pretty good AC with Death Bob. Yeah, pretty good. Almost 40. I'm trading armor as well, so it should go up a little bit too. See how much I could get it up. Uh. And I'm hoping I find um, more shot armor as well. Those are the, the plans. But I, Troll's always a little bit behind on the AC because they can't wear some of their auxiliary armor. But at this point in the game, they're usually pretty good. Which hell do I want to do first? Obviously, I've got to do the side bits first. I must not forget that one, but... Maybe the cold one, I can get up to three cold resist if I trade up my shield, but I lose, what, three shield value? That's not a bad trade-off. Um... Either that or swapping some of the rigs, like putting in that uh, wizardry one again. Which would get me another cold resist, but I'd also have to take off strength, I think. Oh, and I can't fly, which is kind of annoying as well when it comes to doing the frosty level. 
But I think Tartarus is probably the first one. I mean, I know that guys in Tartarus have a spell dead. There we go, 40 AC. Nice and neat again. All right, anyway, let's go to let's go to the Cypress. Don't forget that one. Uh, just double check to got the resist corrosion. Good. Oh, I don't have any resist electric either for the um cold hell, which kind of needs a little bit because of the wind it goes. That's a lot of stuff. Uh I could just emulate these guys. I gotta I gotta fire resist. It's a pretty big slime. Might just sub and slash it. There we go. Apparently the um, emulation explosions don't happen until after you've finished your sub and slash or something so you can use them to escape the explosions occasionally. Not that it matters so much at this point in the game because I'm a bit tougher so the explosions aren't likely to kill me. It's just an interesting thing. Oh, uh... Well, I guess there's no choice but to go down here or read a teleport scroll, but... I should probably take that up staircase, clear it out, make sure I can actually do the spot, uh, maybe? Yeah, I think so. And it looks like I've got a sub cover in the center of the level. When it comes to fighting the royal jelly, because this character will need like a melee spot to fight from. That looks good. All right. Where are you, royal jelly? There it is. I want to mirror it up. Okay. Oh, I'm stuck in here. Uh, I don't get the heavenly storm going, but like, not a good spot for it. Oh, that was a lot of damage. I think I've actually got a teleport. Yeah, and then get my health back. All right, well, hopefully next time I'll get a better fight, like one where I'm not surrounded rather quickly. I probably could have done that a lot better, but it's fine. It only cost me a teleport to reset this. I wonder if it's still wounded or not. I think the raw jelly heals up reasonably quick. No, it's not still wounded. Uh... This is going all right. Not corroded yet. I've managed to build up a bit of the... What is it? Slaying bonus and a evasion bonus, I think. And I'll probably, probably break, but at least I can get the gem. <laughs> uh, what? What? I thought the javelin's here. No, it's just ring of intelligence. The javelin's all the way over here. Oh, yeah. The, oh, wait. No, it's still got 100 returns, but it's going to break. They got an earth manual. Doesn't really help me. <laughs> like, no, these rigs really help me. He also has Shard Dumb somewhere. I can use that. Oh, two of Shard Dumb is excellent. I'm doing all my gold dragon armor. I think I'm going to wear that. So there's, oh, Magic Regen Cold Resist. I did want one of those. Um, I dropped that old reflection one. I don't think that's going to really help much. But the only ones to get the Manifold Assault going, I want the Magic Regen. So. Kind of got, like, options for later on, but nothing that really does much right now. Ooh, more enchant armor. A ring of fire resist electric. Okay, I gotta have that on me, because he does resist electric. I draw my old granite talisman, I think. Oh, wait, I need to read the enchant armor. Read the acquirement is offering a scarf. Oh, a scarf of resist electric. Um, that's actually not bad. I lose a little bit of AC. 
Poison versus Willpower. These are not things I need. Fires also not something I need. Hold up. I might just take the Scarf. I know I lost, lose like 3 or 4 AC. But... Yeah, I mean... Guess with a resistic expose. I don't know why I'm looking at all these items. Anyway, oh, there's a glaive of the guard here. Anyway, I, I can just get out of here, I think. Although I might not know how to get to the lair. I think get... Oh, no, I do. I just got blinked around for a while. So, I've got 10 runes. i got to go to hell. There's no other real choice here. Uh... I think Tartarus... Yeah, Tartarus makes sense. I don't have a Yaras, do I? I prob if I had it, I probably can't cast it yet. I don't think I've got... Oh, I do. But I can't cast it yet. I recommend statue form an icy hell, getting Stoner's Death? You reckon? I reckon... Oh, maybe. But... I have enough willpower. I mean, I can't see in here. I have enough willpower. I don't think I'll get petrified. Yeah, but it's true, I can't, like, yards it up or anything, um, because I don't have that usable just yet. But there's enough guys that torment, I reckon, the uh, statue, um... Yeah, if I had worse willpower, you'd probably be right, though. Okay, let's go down, I lost a bit of strength, which will be fine. That's the least likely one to be reduced to zero. I've entered an ice, um, end ice hell room that 12 plus those guys with Petrify. Huh. And I guess, I guess once they get into melee, they don't take too long to strip your willpower. I don't know. We'll see if I can get Yaras. Maybe. Nah, I don't, I don't know. Why am I going towards the sun guy? Oh, well. Okay, um, my teleport somewhere, I hope I can get to the edge of the map. <laughs> Whatever, it's close enough. Yeah, of course that happened, but if I heavily storm, am I just going to kill these guys? Um, I'm going to try and get the metaphor sword going again, but I don't know if that's Plausible. Uh, not the most healthy right now. Ooh. I'm not sure this heavenly song was a good idea. Now that I think about it, um, I gotta actually, I think I'm gonna blink back, but it doesn't take me very far. <laughs> A bit of a problem. I guess it's far enough. Okay. Can't drink a healing potion or anything, which is a bit of a shame. Do you get it slowed, which helps a bit? And I'm regening up slowly. Yeah, there it goes with the spell of dead. It's kind of the one I was worried about, but I think that's the last is it's a middle there. Which means my health is going back up. Oh, there's one more, but thankfully it's fairly wounded still. Oh, you lit forward a troll and you died to it? Right. No, I mean, I, I can see the, I can definitely see the argument, but I, I kind of want to do the, the fun method and have uh, Lich Form going. I don't know if it's a good idea, though. No, I, I definitely get your argument. Um, ooh. I want to get paralyzed. I think this is fine. I think I can sub and slash. Ooh. 
Um, just for the ice, hell yeah. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't. I think I've got enough willpower that's not going to be a problem, but I could be wrong. Oh. Wish I could move right now. That wouldn't be too bad. Um, I have these fancy martial arts and I can't even move to use them. All right, back to... There we go. Draw such a massive life to with a smite undead and Tartarus isn't bad. Right, no, it's definitely helping a lot. I haven't actually got a ton of fighting, but I've still got a decent amount of health because I kind of spread it into all these other skills. Oh, but Lich from the lesser health race uh, sucks in Tartarus, right? Because you just uh, like a spring or something. You just get spell and dead it. And then it's game over. This does not look like where I need to be. That just looks like a random vault that I don't want to go into. This could be the treasure vault. I go around the outside. I think there's a good chance this was the treasure vault. Uh, not the treasure vault, the boss vault. I need to go around the outside to be 100% sure though. Okay, Translocation is doing well, but I gotta get more? What is the... The last one is like Planewalker or something, which I'm pretty sure I've had. But they got a lot of genie, despite them having no legs, somehow. <laughs> it's game over again. Sure, it's game over. The spring is when they get surrounded by those lich... Uh, the liches. To the middles. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I'm not looking marked, but... I'm gonna actually start a heavily storm. Ah, oh, she got me silenced already. Kind of bad, because she does have paralysis. Uh, oof. Lots of its medals. Oh, no, she got me paralyzed. Okay, I'm no longer paralyzed. Ugh. I mean, she's reasonably wounded, but she's still got me silenced, which means there's not a lot I can do, apart from just keep on doing my martial attacks until she's gone. Yeah, that would have been a nasty spot to be. Oh, yeah, if you were spring, you probably could have run out of that spot at least, but if you're like a kobold or something, might have been a bit worse. There's probably no one home anymore because of that mark trap. Yeah, I can just walk in. All right. I have nothing on my shopping list. The Book of the Mob. Oh, I've got Maxwell's uh, revised electric charge already. All right, let's get out of here. So, 21% of the mana for the salt. Um, how's my fire resistance? It's not good, right? Where do I have left to go is the real question. Oh, I guess I'm... What am I manifold salt pack online? It seems questionable. Am I just doing the Iron City of Dust? I don't have a lot of armor class in here, but I still do damage at least. Wait. Oh, whoops. I, should, I want to bring my statue form, and I want to see... No, actually, maybe I don't. No, never mind. I'll go back in here. I shouldn't have left. That was kind of silly of me because I got a little bit of max health raid. Uh, should try to work off, but... <laughs> this is where I'd love to have that uh, Grey Mole go on or Dyke Mole, but it's not going to happen until later on. <laughs> All right, let's go down again. Ooh. A heavenly storm. Can I... randomly blink so I'm not surrounded? <laughs> Uh, 
All right, that's not too bad. Looks like I can keep fighting from here. And I can keep him moving as well, so my Kevly Storm stays nice and charged up. So I've dealt with these guys. <laughs> oh, drop three floors. Okay. At least I'm charged up my Heavenly Storm, I guess. And I'm still healthy, so that's something at least. Oops, that was just a normal attack. Uh, and these guys are kind of slow, so you can kind of run circles around them, sort of. There are down staircase they can use to keep this heavenly storm going. Not sure there is. Oh, maybe. Actually, I think there's a down staircase in here. And I'm still healthy, so I can go down with a heavy storm going. Let's <laughs> see how much I can get out of this one heavily storm. Uh, where's the rest of these guys? That's the thing about I mean, I've only got one thing of regen. It's like my natural troll regen, but it's still keeping me healthy, right? Oh, this guy will charge it up because it's an iron golem. Oh, it'll also do a little bit of damage to me. Uh... Well, this is actually kind of getting ridiculous with this heavy storm. I gotta see if I can take it to the end of the branch. Oh, I see some dudes chasing after me. Some sentinels, this was actually a bit of a threat, although they seem to be getting taken out right now. I don't know exactly where the boss is, but I have a, like, a rough estimate of where the boss is, and I'm just kind of going off that. I think I'm going... I need to go more down this way. Sometimes there's only, like, one door into the, where the boss is. Which, uh, could cause a problem. Yeah. Oh, this is maybe a problem. Oh, four in yeah, the heavenly storm. Hey, monk dudes. Top it back up. Excellent. Yeah, already back up to like 14 or 15. All right, where's the way in? There we go. There's the door in. And then the next layer, I guess, although I've got one dude in here before I get to the next layer. I don't know which side to go with, so I'm just going to guess this side takes me to the next layer. Oh, okay. I think we've got enough charge here. Hey, so when Jowson braced submission, thou warped half-faced Tyler. Well, I'm certainly a Tyler. I'm definitely playing with tiles. I'm not sure that's quite what they meant, but where are they? Don't run away from me. <laughs> I guess they're scared of my heavenly storm. There we go. Got them. And I'm running low on charge, but that's fine. I don't need a spirit guy. I got the rune. So it took me basically... What level did that take me from? Because I got like shafted down a couple of levels. And I went down a couple of levels. And yeah, I mean, that definitely carried me through here. And I can now get out. Um, oh, 6% fell on the manifold assault. That's not bad. 
I don't know if I should, but I'm going to go full on Mason and Flails. What's the delay on the stock more anyway? Um, it's, oh, it's 28, so you never even reach it, but hey, I'm going to give it a try. Where's next? I got the Fiery Hell, I got the Cold Hell. Oh, I probably should go into the Cold Hell, but I can't fly, can I? I'm like some, I guess boots of flight don't work. Um, I don't want a basic ring of flight. I could just put on this faith outlet, lose my rampage and go to the fiery hell. Oh, I actually did have two things of regen going that whole time. No wonder I was staying so healthy. Um... Actually, I might just... I go with the magic regen ring. Oh, the amulet, and then see how much I can get done with the manifold assault. To make up for not being able to fly up to people. I don't quite make up for it, but... <laughs> Hopefully I should be able to avoid the petrify by not getting next to the guys that petrify. That's my plan. Oh, um, right. Gotta go around the long way. Is there anything I can swap right now so I can... I still got a potential on the strength one makes a lot of sense, although I don't need the fire of this right now. No, I think I'm just good with those. Let's go downstairs. Alright, uh... Struggling to get that, like, lob trap out of sight. Uh, oh, right, reflection. Because I still got the reflection on my shield, even if I've lost the... Um... Oh, misguessed. I lost one of my reflection sources. I lost my amulet of reflection, I think, because I'm wearing a magic regen one. Just trying to get that. Uh, maybe, yeah, that's probably makes sense to wear the magic regen. Hey, don't worry about this guy too much. It just does bolts of cold. I've got three cold resist. Uh... I gotta check on that base of flowers. This has gotta be too slow, right? It's on 3.2 attack delay. Right, because it's not quite as slow an attack anymore because I don't have the statue form on. <laughs> um, Alright, what's the way down? Let's go down. Oh, shrikes. I'm manifold assault. Uh, a hole. Minus move. Whoops. It's going to feel like it's lasting forever. <laughs> Just do a quick serpent slash in here. Uh... Right, it's water there or something. I don't know quite what there is. Either way, I've got that under control. Uh, maybe. Well, next level, fifth level, what have we got? Uh, these guys are fine. Bit of a shame that was next to me, but... Hey, what can I do, right? Alright, that's my way down. Uh, and it is one more level after this. Wait, I should do another heavily storm. Quite a few shrikes. I might summon slash to charge up the heavily storm a bit better. Wait, can I still move a can? Good. 
Word, I got myself trapped in a little corner. Uh, I mean, I can always toss the random blink, but they'll take an action. So I'd rather not. Oh. This does cause piety doing this constant heavily storm, and I want to save some piety for doing the same thing when I get into uh, the tomb, but I don't need a huge amount left. Maybe. I don't know. I feel like I get quite a bit of piety going through here. What's my attack delay right now? So I'm 1.6 attack delay. How does this one compare? It's uh, 2.7, so... Is that like 5 times the attack delay? <laughs> that's 5 times 80, that's a lot. Um, Yeah, I definitely got to bring that one down before it's worthwhile. I lose my shield as well. I just kind of want it for insane manifold assaults, but... Oh, I've stripped on willpower. Right, I should... uh haven't slashed that guy. So I don't get petrified and realize I can't actually get rid of the petrification in here. Oh, that guy was robust. <laughs> I get it with so many manifold souls. I mean, it really does come down to... Actually, they do have random hit points, so it could have literally been more robust. But it also comes down to my random damage as well. How well that one rolls. Uh... That's going to make me go around the long way, isn't it? This um, layout, because I don't have flight, so I had to go around the whole outside of the level. That's okay, I guess. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what this is making me do. Uh... Actually, no, this is a, this is a separate one, um, but it's still going to make me go around the whole level. It's a, oh, I'm petrifying. Well, before I petrify, I should sub and slash some of these guys. Oh, it's more. <laughs> sure. Uh, check this again it's 2.5 uh, tag delay but it is up to like 200 damage or something <laughs> as damage is going up it was only I think it started on like 150 also would it be ridiculous it's probably a little ridiculous no I won't do it in here <laughs> um Wanting to try my metaphor salt, but I think I'll wait till I get to the fiery hell before I try that one. Uh, I think this is leading right up to the boss, right? Going up this way. I mean, I've done enough of the level, it probably is unmarked. Uh, sure. I can teleport in here, at least if I need to, but I don't currently. Oh, hey, Seven of Hell. I might teleport out and go get rid of the mic and heal up and stuff. Oh, there we go, Seven of Hell again. I think a number of things were coming along towards me because I heard the mic there. Wait, can I not get that trash without flight? I don't think so. Oh, well. Gotta be a test, like, any... Oh, wait, there's another level? Another layer, I mean, to this place before I get to a test? Right, it's this one that leads to a test. Sure.
I don't, not too scared of this guy. It's just right up. What is it trying to do? Trying to hit me with some little bolts of cold or something? It's funny with the exception of like the brimstone feeds. A lot of the tormenting guys are kind of not that bad without it. I guess actually. No, I guess a lot of the ones from Extended are a bit worse, but the actual tormentors are pretty harmless. All right. Can't drink any potions to buff up, so there's no point in like ending my form here. What's he got on him? I reflected something back at him. He's got a ring of invasion and dagger. Okay. Can I have like some curare that I can hit him with? Although I'd probably slow him anyway, to be perfectly fair. Oh, minus move. I mean, that doesn't work the best because there was a lot of wood up there that I couldn't move up to. Well, I couldn't move around you to. Right, we're good. We've got the... Got everything. Let's get out of here. We've got the rudeness. Oh, wait. Don't go to... Where am I going there? Cosiders 1? Something like that? That's not quite right. Anyway, so there's Gehenna the Tomb. I gotta try on the dark mall and go into Gehenna and see how this works. I hope this is a bad idea. It's 2.3 attack delay. I mean, this could be silly, but... Uh, I also need some fire to the source. Two good enough. Two is probably good enough. And theory still works with the Wujian attacks, except my move delay is considerably faster than my attack delay. Minus move. Of course. Yeah, like then I think I failed to hit the elephant. And I'm marked. Uh. Right, next level. How's my dex going? Because that was the one that's been drained a little bit here. Alright, how many levels is there? Seven of them down to level four. Levels promising to trap me forever, but I doubt that's going to happen. Alright, next level down. How's the Mason Flails going? 18. Um, I am not doing so well at getting a title here. And, oh well. I was gonna go for a Wujia one, but like there's a lot of wasted skill and like there's not much of the game left. Um <laughs> I could possibly no, I don't know if I could, but I could possibly like switch to some other god, do a bit of a ziggurat, then continue on my merry way, but that seems a little crazy. Uh, all right, there's a way to the last level. Let's go down. Funny, that guy trying to thread me with like a fireball and it can't even get up to me. Oh, I need more magic points. So at this level, I can't read scrolls, but I can potentially potion up if I end my form before I fight the boss. I probably should. I should put on Brilliance and Haste. I want such a slow attack delay versus the boss. Uh-oh. Wait, what just happened there? Did I do no damage or these guys do no damage? I think it might have been those guys that did no damage in one of their attacks. I don't know. I just saw the, the word no damage in the lock. Like, wait, was I hitting with no damage with a... Dark mode? That would be kind of funny. What is my damage on? 100, uh, 213. Uh, 
Wait, when they do that little large attack, does it take one attack delay despite this being a dark mall? Quite possibly does. I wonder whether it's guaranteed or not. It might not be guaranteed to happen. It might be like the little whirlwind attacks. Alright, well this is... The boss is going to be right around that corner. So I might put on my buffs right now. So definitely brilliant because I got endless of that. And then haste. Uh, okay, there we go. That's the boss. Do I have enough magic boys to flatten the boss? There we go. What's the magic? Please be something you saw. Maces and flails. How about that? But I've only got one rune left. I don't really have a lot of time here. I don't care about that Sabd and I don't care about the whip of uh tailbinder or whatever it is. Oh, uh, can't move. Sure. So I believe it's just two left, um, which is going to be a little bit hard. I'm not exactly the right sort of character for that, but at least I got a glitch form. I guess with a liberal use of brilliance, I might be able to keep on manifold sorting people with haste. I got enough haste and brilliance left. Oh, the requirement here. What's that give? Dodging? Sure. Also, Ice Dragon Armor, Staff of Fire, none of those are that useful. Manual Dodging is at least, like, theoretically something I might get if I ever get a bunch of spare XP, which I probably won't, given how far into the game I am right now. A fourth set failure on the uh, metaphor assault now. What am I training? Just the maces and flails. What's changed? I don't know. Oh, you don't have the shield anymore. I think that's what brought up my chance of the metaphor assault. Yeah, one way down. There should only be one way down, I believe, unless I break open walls, which I don't have shatter, so I can't. So I might as well buff, go down, uh, definitely put on brilliance. That's going to be good. I guess I'll do a haste as well, because I got some of those left. I think it's probably a good thing to have. Yep. Chopping down their numbers. Oh, a net. All right. Oh, finish my manual maze and flail. So it got me to 23. What else can I really ask for? Right. Am I just a revelations? Okay. I'm going, going towards the staircase, which is nice. And. Uh, Love well, the ban you, I guess, and then get out of there. There we go. That can let up most stuff, I think. Oh, Battle Soul Soul was just recently redone. And Max Power does four tanks but for unarmed and always hits. Wait, it's isn't it more than that? Isn't it six that Max Power now with unarmed? But I'm doing a uh, I'm doing this like massive flail, so it's up to twelve except I don't think I've got max power. I've already got thirty percent power, so that's whatever that is. Um Let me ask the bot. Uh I think it's that. Six attacks. 6.4, whatever. Still not too bad. Oh, sounds like uh, the start of a Chuck Norris joke. Chuck Norris throws horseshoes at rings that don't exist and never misses. I mean, I guess if you're throwing at rings that don't exist, it'd be hard to miss. Or maybe you always miss. I don't know. Anyway, what have we got? Money? Do I need money? Do I need a money star? I don't need, I don't have faith I got another one of those. I don't need the money, but I might as well be rich. Uh, I got a teleport. I can go to the other side. Ooh, first try.
I think I lost a little bit of my intelligence. Some of that might have been for a mutation. You know what? I might actually reset these mutations because I got the death bomb on, so I can't. Minus stacks? Nah, let's not go with that. Oh, more magical energy. Clarity of mind and my armor is less encumbering. Yeah, that sounds good. All right. Excellent. 3% failure on the Matterfall Assault now because my armor being less encumbering. Oh, actually, I need to take my form back off just uh, before I go down the staircase to be more brilliance. Oh, sure, might. Heist. Definitely form back up and then go down. Oh, actually, am I trying to teleport to the center of the level? Right. Oh. That did some damage to me. I think I survived the fire, so I'll just cast again. Let's watch the sea of fire spreading. Uh, watch my hit points going down a little bit. Uh... This is not actually perfect. Being in the center of here is maybe not right. I think I'm going to have to blink, but this is unfortunate. Um, there's still a net trap there, which is not what I want to see either. I just cast again, though. Ooh, that didn't work at all. Oh, that's a shame. Um, oh, that's the exit. Okay, let's take it. Oh, the way up. Right. No, oh, did something. I definitely heard some guys before I had to get out of there. Also, with this Shadow title, have I ever had that before? I think so, right? Yes, twice. Alright. Um... I'll say more buffs, so the brilliance. Not that I needed it last time because I didn't stick around long enough. Uh, might... Heist. Pull on the talisman again. Go back down. Oh. Whoops. Wrong staircase. That sucks. I think it's fine. Uh, oh. Uh, I don't know if it'll speed me up much, but I'm going to advise this guy. Oh, mm. someone saw the sparsel. Also, I lost all my buffs. Uh, I'm going to use another blinking because I got them. I might use two more to get. I like how that sparsel is looming over me, though. Ah, they stood on it. I think I can just manifold assault these guys. That dude's slow, so am I, so... Oh, how did it catch up? Anyway, I'll go upstairs. Guess it lost it slow before I did. Uh, right. Well, I think doing this again, I'm making some decent progress, so I should be able to just do this whole thing all over again. Brilliance, haste, form, go down. Wait, where is everyone? Oh, there might not even be anyone left here. Sure, I guess I just ought to explore for a little while. And grab my ziggurat, so I don't uh, I don't think I need that cloak anymore. I probably don't need to, actually don't need the tower to cover this because I uh, put on an amulet instead of like magic regen, I think. Excellent. There's my rune. Um, I guess I'm done with this. I kind of want to do a ziggurat. I don't know if that's a silly idea, but I kind of do. So I'm going to go try one, <laughs> wherever one is. Uh, zig. Got the little figurine, but I might just take the natural one. Yes. Go in. Wait, no. Drop items. Uh, 
I think the rocks are useful, the boomerangs, but the javelins are still useful. Keep the faith. What is the best ammo? Because magic regen is not going to be the most helpful. Uh, minus fire. Okay. Faith fire resist? Uh, I mean, cold resist is still fine. I don't know. Hopefully I'll find something better. Do any of these scrolls use this now? Uh, poison might still be used. I think it might be useful anymore because I'm lich formed up. Lignification's not that useful. Alright. Go in. See what happens. First guy's always pretty weak. I mean, sometimes it's actually pandemonium lord, I think. So it's not guaranteed to be weak or anything. Alright, what have we got? We got, ooh, strength, lots of it. Resist electric. It's got random corrosion, minus three and a bit of dags. It is a lot of strength. Why can't I just, oh, I did just pick it up. I got the strength fire this one, which uh, is actually kind of nice, but. Oh, I dropped my cloak. I maybe shouldn't have, because uh, that would allow me to go back to it. I don't think I'll swap to that one. Could lose the protection and grab the strength instead. 330 damage. Let's give it a try. See how it looks instead of the AC. There's a lot of AC to lose. 350. Now it's not worth it. I want the AC instead. Okay, well, the tower shield. Let's get that last magic point before I go down. I think I'm going to need every magic point I can get to this game. Um, oh, really? Gotta, gotta end the form. Drink the experience. Do I just get a title or... What am I? I'm a troll. I beat Shapeless Troll. I've had lots of troll ones. I think there was a god one left. Let's just do a check out the ones. Um, so... Oh, those are... That's not right. That's... All the titles I've had. <laughs> Twelve is a slayer. Yes, slayer is a really common one. Uh, I want to. I want to specifically look for trolls. Deadly accurate. Okay, I think I've had the ballista one, haven't I? Yeah, I have. I've had the shield one, the barricade one. Iron troll, I think, was armor. Shapeless is the shape shifting. Uh. Oh, I should get a little bit of fighting. Oops. Huh? <laughs> I agree with that thing saying, huh? Anyway, let's get uh, let's get some fighting. I think that's the thing to get right now. Then I think I'll have to go for an invocations title eventually. Even though that's kind of a waste of uh, experience, unfortunately. Oh, whoops. My form is not on. Maybe should have brought those lignifications with me for situations like that. Oh, plus 10 strength. Still not tempting me out of uh, the extra protection, I don't think. I think that's basically my only defense. Um, uh, that's a, uh, what is that ring? Resist the lad rig, minus five resist, four strength. No, it's not that good. I like these orc levels because they're never too bad. It's like they're definitely doable. Oh, the crown. Resist electric. What do I even have on my head? I have willpower intelligence. Oh, actually, I like my one. My current one. Uh, it's giving six intelligence, which is very important. It allows me to have a little bit more power. In fact, I need anything I can get of intelligence, I think. Though with how little item slots I've got, it might be pretty hard to get any more stuff of intelligence. Uh, willpower is this corrosion? No. What else have we got on the ground? It's a magic point intelligence fire this ring. Like, honestly, maybe. Um, which one of these strength ones do I drop? 
Oh, we got Dex and stuff on it. I don't think that guy dropped the crown, do I? Oh, if I've had a good cloak, maybe not. Wait, I can read the enchant armor on my armor. That's a good thing to do. And then I can pick up the ring. It does rain you when you take it off, so that's fine. Um, I'll try it on the set of my strength one. See how that goes. 120? No, 220? That's... That even changed my damage much? I guess it did. I think it was 230 or 40 before. Okay. Oh, more enchant armor. You get a lot of enchant armor in around, so I should be able to max out my armor at least. Give me back a little bit of the potential I'm so desperately missing. Oh, come on. Anything's bad fortunes are going to get me killed. Well, probably not, but it's just like I gotta remember to put my form back on after I kill one, which I might eventually forget. Uh, that scroll torment has some use. Which one of these is useless? Shall have the faith outside of here. I don't think I'm gonna use that. Do I just drop that shield of reflection? I don't know. Ah, silence is useless. Alright. Because uh, the torment can be useful for, the, for some gruesy creatures to get the fight going. Do you also remember I do have some emulation scrolls remaining if I need to use those as well. Amulet of willpower, clarity. Don't I have clarity already as a mutation? I don't need willpower. Resist negative. No, nah, I don't need that one. Let's just keep on going. I got to drain some of my magic points that statue. And of course, I used a ton of them as well. Just by casting spells. Okay. How much was I getting with that fighting? Was I getting up to 20? I think 20 is a reasonable amount. That's just the stuff with all the stuff on it. All the magic points and all that sort of things. How much power did I get with the Battlefall Assault? 37%. I mean, that's a little bit more since I got the uh, increased intelligence. Ah, minus move. Okay. Oh. Uh, I'll start with one of these little serpents. Uh, little storm. struggling to hit these guys. What's my attack delay? 1.6, so it's got a decent chance of doing it every time I move, but it's not guaranteed by any stretch of the imagination. Alright. Yep, 20 is good. Uh, oh, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go for the title and hope for the best. <laughs> what have I actually got to get it up to, though? Oh, my Mason Flower's on 26. So I gotta get it all the way up to, like, 26 point two or something. Sure. I'll wait out the heavenly storm, but I was definitely tempted to go down while it's still running, but put on my form. There we go. Okay, this is Oh, there's a ghost moth. I should just try and emulate these guys, but how am I going to set that off? Maybe with a grab a tambourine? Uh, I could probably just finish the rest off with a heavenly storm. Yeah. Oh, not if they barf me. Uh, oh, what's the defense against barbs? I mean, I guess I'll emulate some more of these guys, and I guess I'm just going to have to move anyway. There we go. Yes, I mean, getting getting all my magic points raised is always going to be a problem. I feel like a lot of characters kind of struggle just a little bit with that level, getting their magic points drained. 
Good. Get off that invocation. Gain the multiple levels. That's what I like to see. Gain the multiple levels again. Good. I want to be on 16, so I might be able to get where I need to get. Uh, it's not yet at the point where it's getting me more magic points than the spellcasting would, though. Can't actually hit that invisible guy, can I? Without, like, going out of my way to hit it. <laughs> Kwame wants to give me Fire the Spore End, or Fanfolio. Oh, I'll just take the money. I'm not a Gozag, unfortunately, so the money doesn't actually help, but oh well. Yeah, usually in Ziggurats, at least if you take the money, it gives you something. Uh... No way I don't run out of magic points here, right? We'll see. Oh. Slowed, which means my attack delays are really slow. I think I'm going to blink back, unfortunately. Um... Oh, come on. Hit the ban, you please. Oh, it's got another life. What can I do to it? I guess I can grab a tambourine, but then what? Uh, I don't have a tremor stones. I have a wand of light. I have a wand of whopping. Maybe a wand of light or... Oh. Didn't do much. Um, I'm gonna mirror it up. Huh? Give me a servant slash. How did I not damage this guy? Oh, it's too slow. My weapons are too slow to land a blow. Ouch. Uh, got six magic points. Okay. Got seven magic points. I can head it. Oh, I didn't do much with the manifold assault either. This is an actual problem. Do I have any roots? I do not. Oh, he did not hit it. Oh, thank goodness. Right, it's uh, beginning to get difficult to do some of these levels. Um, right. That's my attack delay. It's probably still around 1.6. Yeah, it is. I'm going to be training that for a little while. i been doing the invocations. Oh, good. More enchant armor. Oh, three of them even. All right, I think I'm on plus a, uh, 11, yep. Spirit Guardian isn't quite what I'm after because I had strong with my magic points. It would not make those better. It would make those a bit worse, even. Charm weapons don't help. Let's just go down. Hold up. I have a little bit of brilliance. That's a ghost moth, isn't there? What is there? What just drained my magic points there? Something did. It is a ghost moth. Of course it is. Um, I'm going to read my torment on these guys. Get them a bit wounded and then hit them with the lightning. Um, I, I'm constrained, but I might still try and heavenly storm. It's berserk. It hasn't reconstructed me, thankfully. Oh, now it has. Uh, and I'm reconstructed again. Oh, come on. Minus blink, aren't I? I could do a server slash, but unfortunately I'm constricted, so it could take a little while to get going. Is 
There we go. Excellent. Another level finished off. Level 19 of this thing around. Hey, I've got a little poison icon on me now. What if I got that one? Anyway. Oh, Vise? I should maybe be using Vise a little bit more, shouldn't I? Huh. Good idea. Yeah, because I do have that one. Okay, 15 in the invocation. This is getting somewhere. Oh, look at the no poison icon on me. I'm actually waiting that poison off. There we go. Just so in case I have to end my death form or something and I don't want the poison to immediately reappear. No, vice is definitely a good idea. Um, do I have enough? I put it on a brilliance before I go down, but unfortunately I lose a bit of time before I even get into the battle. Quite a lot of time before I even get into the battle. I think the Heavenly Storm charges up when I do a manifold assault. But still. Does something for me. So that's another level collab. Ooh, they're getting definitely a bit, uh, bit more risky though now. Um, not sure if I'm going to make it to all the way to the end of this ziggurat. Okay. Oh, wait. Hold up. I need to end that form again. Put on the brilliance. Put on the form. Go back down. Most I don't want to swing at nothing. I don't have a lot to repel these guys' missiles, but at least they're in view in small enough quantities. They're in about the right quantity, sort of the point where I can manifold assault most of them. Uh, yeah, I needed the brilliance. I so much needed the brilliance that time round. Uh, that's the last enchant I'm going need to do. Unless I'm going to like try and enchant up a shield or something, but I don't think so. I think that strength is worthwhile. I mean, it's kind of a good strength ring. No, I don't think it's worthwhile. Yeah, what do you got? Strength, dex on a spirit guardian, and we've got... Oh, minus cast. Well, never mind about the minus cast. Let's, uh... Off the experience. I have 19 on the invocations. Strength of brilliance, which I must get another one, because I'm still on 8 of those. Ooh, there gonna be some shot strikes? We'll see. Nope, just the vessel creatures. All right. There's too many of them. My clouds are not spreading properly. Um. I don't want to get paralyzed by how many of these guys there are. That way was my Heavenly Storm here. Come on, Heavenly Storm. I think I'm out of magic points as well. Uh... Right. Here is more. How's my health? It's still going okay. Is the last guys remaining? Because they might be good. Ooh, I, the Wujin's all right in a ziggurat. I just don't think they're the best god ever. They're doing something. They're not quite Gozag levels of power, but no one is. Uh... I don't really think they're useful stuff, so... Next level, I guess. Put on the Brilliance. Put on the Death Seismen. Head on down. Please don't 
cancel me up or something. Oh, did they get me with a cancellation? Might have missed. Still brilliance. Oh, there goes the brilliance. All right. We well, it's only a matter of time before somebody got the brilliant squad there, but yeah, I think I'm good now. Or does it cost the turn to abandon your god? Um, I thought so. Not actually a hundred percent sure, but I'd say probably. Wait, does it say in the menu here? Costs nothing. It doesn't say it's instant, so I think so. Or oh, in a life and death situation where you need to abandon Oakwire to use a scroll of butterflies. Oh, no, I think it does take a turn. It doesn't say it's instant. Um, I have to test some Wismo to be 100% sure. Like, it's like an offline game or something, but... Because I know some things say they're instant. I think all the things that are instant say so. I hope so, anyway. Oh, it's manual starves. Okay. How do you regen a blink here? I don't think I need that. So let's just... Quaff the brilliance. Go down again. Level 24 of the ziggurat. Okay. Oh, you're making a game in a different version just to find out. Yup, that's a good idea. Oh, got me. I was hoping I'd get a... Hoping I'd get a vice going there, but... Apparently not. Bit bad. I'm out of magic points again. Um... Charge yourself with a little bit of Serpent Slash. Those are mostly weak things, right? Although there are some guys here that can dispel and dead. Should probably keep away from those using this Heavenly Storm here. Apparently the Heavenly Storm didn't used to be like capped at 15. It used to be able to go up to like hundreds. You just have endless evasion or something, which is kind of funny. I guess endless slaying as well, so you'd be damaging things really well, but not quite true anymore. Uh... I think I'm up to 24, right? Yeah, 24 skill. Uh, reflection with strength. No, I don't have a shield with that one anymore. It's a little unfortunate. Okay, well, I can brilliance up again. And then go down to level 25. Okay. Oh, it's one of these. Will I have to skip this level or will this be fine? That's way too many health sentinels. Um the entire army of those dudes. Uh I don't really want to skip this level, but I might need to. I think I do need to. At least I need to get some health back. Um... Oh, no. Minus move. Minus tally as well. That's unfortunate. Oh, fragile. Yeah, this is uh, bad. Do I just leave the cigarette completely? I think I do. Without my figurine. Oh, it's a little bit of a shame, but... Oh, what am I on? 80 health? Okay. That's alright. Whew. 
Right, <laughs> that's as deep as I could get, unfortunately. Well, this has got a chance. Let's go to Zod 5, I think, is where I've got to go now. It's going to be a definitely... Oh, don't exclude. I'm trying to unexclude. Um, This is going to be a downgrade difficulty, I think. Got to be careful with my, my magic points, slow. But it's not going to be quite ziggurat levels. So I didn't quite get the last... Uh, I think it was the th last three levels. Well, I did the... I was on the... One of them, but I didn't... Oh, one hit of normal fire. <laughs> didn't complete the last two, and I... Well, I did do the last two. I didn't visit the last two, and I didn't complete the... Third from last one. Is what I'm trying to say. Did good? Yeah, I think I did reasonably good, but didn't quite make it all the way there. Okay, three hit that over fire. Not too bad. <laughs> but where are we going to get... Uh, Point four of a skill level from is the real question. I mean, I might be able to get something in here. I can do both sides, I guess. And then I could just do like a little piece of pandemonium or something. Got all my runes, so there's no point in doing it for runes or anything. Oh, what am I? Blind? He said a cloud blind, so I get... I get, like, Disco Vision. I've never had that on another Ziggurat. Oh, the only problem is you weren't wearing the Granite Talisman, so I didn't get ridiculous damage. I mean, that's fair enough. I could, actually. Like, the first few levels of another Ziggurat. Oh. Dude, silence me. That's just mean. I even do my god abilities while silenced. Okay, good. I can back, back to metaphor sorting. Wait, hold on, I'm Sifu. I did it, I got the title. There's just enough XP here and, um, Zot 5. Alright. Uh, well, hold up. I need, uh, I got a faith on me, right? I do. I need to check exactly which title I'm going for here, because I know there was one left. It's... God equals Wujian, S equals title, and then I'm going to go to the title page, see which one it is left. God titles, okay. W would be the end, right? Maybe? There it is. Start for the high party ones, because those are the ones I usually get. So, I've had Sifu, right? Let's see. Yeah, I have. I've been a golden sash. Uh, yes, I have. Good. We've been a red sash. Yes. But a young dragon. Yes. Young tiger. I'm pretty sure I got this one. Where is it? Yes, I've been that one. Young crane. Maybe not? Uh... I don't think I'd be the young crane, so I need to get down to one pip of piety. So looks like I got that. I got the young dog one as well to go later on. I don't think there's a no, there's no parents one. So right, go grab my orb. Go to dungeon level zero. Well, of course, these guys are gonna try and stop me, but I don't think they're gonna do so well. I got magic regen, so that's probably all I need. I should check what this guy does. I've slowed it though. I'm hitting it over the head. Oh, no, all the It's probably still fine. Oh, I'm manifold assaulted because it's 100% hurt. And I'm not massively accurate or anything. Alright, master invocation. Let's just get fighting or whatever. Um, oh, I might as well get the mason flails as well. Oh, in fact, I should probably just get mason flails because... um. I actually do. I haven't actually reached Mendeley yet on this one. I've already had the dodge exit. Well, that was quick. Okay, let's lo go lose some piety. Um, uh, remove. Yes. I'm a red sash. Where is it? I got all these items because I did the ziggurats. Okay, remove the face. I mean, young dragon. Maybe next one. No, I'll probably have to swap twice more, I reckon. 
Remove the face of a young tiger, which I've had. Okay, remove the face. I'm a young crane. Excellent. I might just dump my magic regen amulet on, on get out of here. That was a fun game. And I got a unique trike title out of it. I had a dark ball, which I didn't start with. I started with unarmed, but I think it was worth getting. Just for the fun factor, if nothing else. Um, oh, I saw the charm diver left at the end because I did the Ziggurat. Well, that was, a, that was a nice little game. I think it was reasonably quick. Like, four and a half hours for 15 runes. Uh, most of the Ziggurat. I had one, in, uh, one damage gem, one shadow gem from Slime Pits, I think. Alright, I think that takes me to five on my streak, but I might, uh, I might finish up there. <laughs>